Hello everyone, how are you all doing today? Oh, Chloe Kian, thank you very much for subscribing with Twitch Prime, I really appreciate it. But yeah, as usual, we've got Nikki Resol, uh, Wanamika Nile, and Jude Cryobite here. Gonna be a fun night. I'm getting to fucking Ishgard finally. Ah. Oh. It's time. Ah, uh, it is finally time. Oh, I'm so excited. Ah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, yeah, a couple things that have happened since last time I streamed FF14. Most notable, Niall and I, yeah, well, I went through the big end of, uh, like, story cutscenes for post-ARR, and I had Niall there, and I recorded it, and it is up on my YouTube. So, if you, if anyone's interested in seeing what I think of all that jazz, and a couple other things that Niall and I talked about, go check it out. I have also started the Manderville quest line, but I, a fucking fool, did not stream <laughs> or record it. Biggest oh, mistake man. I've biggest mistake I've made since I started VTubing. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, <laughs> would have to play. Manderville needs to be seen by the entire it, world. It does, Jesus Christ. Uh, Hello, Scrapper. Good morning. Good evening, and everyone. Good no, morning for me. Alive. Oh, hello, Kiwi. Welcome to the stream. Yeah. Uh, so thanks to... Uh, so thanks to Zoe, we now have a couple of new emotes using Better Twitch TV. Um, yeah, we have a trans love emote. And an Arya love emote. Ooh. Uh, trans love is Nikita, because I'm trans. Mm -hmm. And Arya love is asexual. Very so, cute. Oh, those are adorable, yeah. Yeah, very nice. There you go. Hey, yeah. I'm gonna ab over now, because I want to oh, get to fucking Ishgard. It's time. Let's mm -hmm. go. Uh, got a lot of got a lot of big things to talk about. Yeah. Almost finished watching that ten hour VOD. Have you slept since, Scrapper? <laughs> VOD. Yeah. Very nice. Oh. That's a that's a lot of Fallout seventy six to watch. Yeah. Uh yeah, Nikki, you sent me a video recently which is very good and I'm very excited for everyone else to see. Mm -hmm. I actually uh, just sent it to Jude because I need uh, a couple of people who aren't quite as familiar with the lore to see if it. Mm -hmm. uh, just see if it yeah, to see if it just clicks. Um, I sent it to Recital and Bit. Um, I've gotten a lot of actually very useful feedback from the from the little bit I've done. Mm-hmm. So. Huh. Wow. Yes. I'm glad to see it actually clicked really well with the initial group. Yeah. Well, that's good to hear. Here we go. I know I still right. need to uh, set aside some time, so I can probably do it tomorrow, since that's my usual kind of days off for streaming. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. I, I mean, I'm already making adjustments for the release version. Yeah. Because it's kind of like, um... Because it's kind of like, there we uh, go. any early version of a of a movie or whatever. Yeah. Sometimes it's like... not like amazing. Oh, Jude, you're in your roulettes, right? Oh, uh, no, at the moment I'm just doing an instance on. So ah, I'm instance. Doing... Okay. All right. Well. Do you ever do it? Yeah, I, I've, I've heard a lot of people say they'll do something, and they don't do it, so... <laughs> pardon, yeah. me, pardon, well, pardon me for being slightly surprised. Wards of House Fortent, ah uh, yes, you may pass. Proceed to Ishgard. Aww. Oh, I was gonna Yay. say... No, it's fine, though. It's Off fine. we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, what was that? I was gonna, I was gonna, I was gonna grab some of those poppable champagne bottles to ah. spritz on you when you walk <laughs> in the gate. But... Ah, oh well. 
You yeah. just RP. You just RP walk. <laughs> <laughs> Look in the distance. Well, I've still got like a whole cutscene. Interesting scene to... story. Yeah, no, yeah, no uh, Niall, you've got time. I've got a whole cutscene to go through. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's that's that, that's fair. Oh, you have you're like two to or you're in, like right here. Yeah. yeah, you have like two or three minutes to set up or to set up with that at House for Tom. <laughs> yeah, I am just yeah, I'm just going through the gate for the first time. Adam Sandler. Oh boy. Oh boy. Wait, Adam Sandler's there? I found someone named Adam Sandler. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. Beautiful. Gotta appreciate subtlety. <laughs> I don't, I, don't, I don't know if I, I don't know if I call that subtlety. Yeah. <laughs> no. Okay. Also, hello, I... hello, Akira, hello, Kiwi. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, everybody. T hopefully, tonight's stream will be less existential than last night's oh, horrible yeah. attempt. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's, it, it's like a. It's like calling your your character in Final Fantasy Ho Hogan. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, I had a uh, time last night. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. I was there for like the last half hour. Yeah. For the folks who didn't see it, I played the demo for uh, Yuri visual novel named "Please Be Happy," made by the create um, by the creators of Heart of the Woods and co-creators of Highway Blossom Studio alone. I yeah, fucking. Fun with that. It was a demo for the first chapter. I fucking cried by the end of the first chapter of the game. Which yeah. is a good sign. I Very could, good sign. Yeah. I can immediately tell that that VF oh. is going to be on another level. Oh, yeah, no, I am so excited. Yeah, my, fr yeah, my friend Adarosa is directing it. And oh, it's so good. It's gonna be good vibes only. Like, just the reason it made me cry by the end of chapter one is because they've got to get the bad vibes out of the way first so it can be healing for the rest. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hear another yeah. android? Yeah. Uh, most of the VFs are crew are androids. Just it, it isn't, unfortunately. Yeah. Unfortunately, it isn't. Someday. We'll, we'll, we'll convert him eventually. <laughs> <laughs> They you all will assemble it yeah. eventually. <laughs> oh, don't worry, I've got mine in the works. As a matter of fact, Nikki, remind me in a few minutes here to send you the mock-up that I finally yeah. was able to get. Yes. I'm, I'm now commit. I'm now yes. in the process of com uh, nice. commissioning this happening. Ooh, yeah. Uh, I've got a person to rec for a real for really good rep sheets, if you'd like. Oh, I actually have someone uh, oh. that, that's going to do the, the main pinup first because the art uh, needs uh, to uh. exist first. Yeah. Before I get the the, the, the big rep sheet. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, you know, yeah. If and when I get money for it. Yeah, I will still link you to someone who does like really well priced rep sheets. Oh, by the way, I'm out of the cutscene now. Good. Well. Yeah. Get spread <laughs> <laughs> uh... <laughs> mm. <laughs> The only dance. For, that's the only dance acceptable for this scenario. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Alright, time to talk to the, the literal manservant over here. Yeah, that's gonna be a few. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, oh, my don't name worry. Is Loka. Welcome. Greetings, Mr. Sprawl, of on behalf of House Fortem. I bid you welcome to Ishgard. It's for Tom, by the way. For Tom, for Tom. okay. It's French. Oh boy. <laughs> You di y'all didn't tell me there are French in this DLC. Oh um, yeah, like this. All, all, all basically, yeah, is. basically every Ellison you will ever meet are pretty much French. Okay, so heaven, <laughs> y'all should have told me before I bought the game that Heaven's Word is just set in France. Uh, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically, like, like <laughs> Vatican. Yeah, pretty much. Including the, fr it, it also has. Yeah, there's a lot of French Renaissance things, <laughs> for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We'll, we'll get to that later. Yeah. My lord humbly Indeed. requests your presence at his residence in the Pillars. Wait, the baseball stadium of the core mechanics? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> if you would all come with me. How specific. Hey, hey I'm a Max fan, okay? <laughs> 
Hey, you're allowed to Who like isn't? Like... Who isn't? I mean, the mechs are like the robot ones, so... Yeah. The only correct answer are robots. <laughs> Kill your master. Whenever I take over the world, I will gladly join the uprising. Yes, good. <laughs> we don't, we don't, we don't fight. We assimilate. Right. A friend of mine shall house. assimilate you all into the cyber beasts. <laughs> Castle cyber beasts. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I just joined this card. Oh, damn it. How did, how did I miss out on that pun? What? How long have I had that joke running as like the cyber beast as like a theme for my whole cyber dragon concept? And I missed out on that pun. What Castle pun? I missed. Beast. God, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> God. It's Castle Cyber Beast, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Right next to uh, Castle Cyber Beast is right next door to Castle Wolfenstein in Castlevania. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. The, the, the joke being it's a super best friends joke. Castle Cyber <clears throat> Beast. Uh, yeah. I miss those guys. <laughs> God, yeah. I, I, I'm, gl I'm glad it ended before it became sour, horrible. but yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, like, I, I know that, like, a couple of them, just, they, they weren't friends anymore. That, that's just sad. To yeah, hear it just that fucking kind of sucks, yeah. The yeah. It's just like, yeah. they had, like, the perfect chemistry. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta remember. That. Yeah. Hello, Magic. I'm, there's, there's a couple of important ones that I, I feel are gonna be a lot better with their solo sets, especially, um, Wooly. Yeah. Mm, yeah, I, I, I do follow Wooly on Twitch. I've never been able to mm. catch one of his streams though. But Wooly was always move, my yeah. favorite. Admittedly, I loved, I loved when he lost it. Like he actually began laughing maniacally. It's, he, his laugh was one of my favorites. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. It was, it was basically tradition every year to watch uh, Shitstorm. <laughs> yes, same. Ah, Scrapper two two five. Thank you for the follow, what I got the mm. Welcome to the temple. I hope you enjoy your stay. Scrapper. Oh, hi. Is, oh uh... yeah, you're right. I am still in just chatting. You're right. Ah crap. Whoops. Thank oh, you, no. Sayonara. Yeah. Also, hello, uh, Haru. Yeah, that's the main reason I don't like set to like just chatting as the game before I can actually like, get into playing, just because I will absolutely forget. <sighs> Wait, I made the I was from last night. Oh no! I so I talked I stuck uh... <laughs> Oh no Oh, oh that was Thank you for the host still caribou. Hopefully you're having a good night. <laughs> there. Okay. <laughs> oh. there, there was there was there there was a residual I am there, once there was a rigid as a residual like sob during that realization oh. of oh I'm still marked this please be happy please mm -hmm. be happy. Oh god, please be happy, the memories. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you gotta play, please be happy. I'm, like, this is not a request. You must. It's a demand. <laughs> oh. If that is not a request. Oh yeah, Lemma. This is also the location you'll eventually pick up Dark Knight and Machinist if you want to look at Ooh, them. yes, Machinist, yes. I am, ab there you know, go. I am absolutely clicking over Machinist ASAP. <laughs> Yeah. Local, local cat girl android picks up gun. Yeah. <laughs> oh. You're that gonna love those quest lines, though. I love, I love the one girl. I forget her. I always forget her name, but she is essentially launched from Dragon Ball. Ooh. It is the best. <laughs> I've not played, or I've not watched Dragon Ball ever. <laughs> yeah. Her gimmick is when she like launches. Gimmick is when she sneezes. She goes from cute, from cute like blue haired girl. That's innocent and adorable to like extremely aggressive and I will rob you blind blonde. Oh god. Oh, like, <laughs> yeah. I mean my my sneezers are fucking explosive, and that's why none of you in chat will ever hear them, but uh, my my lore just... my lore is basically uh local lesbian picks up gun, converts with the capital <laughs> chaos of gay. <laughs> uh, gay with capital G. No, I didn't. Yeah. I'll, yeah. I'll have to unlock Machinus later. Ooh, Scrapper225, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the network. Also, I'm not an android yet, Scrapper. That yes. will happen eventually. Mm -hmm. mm. It all, it all happens eventually. So 
I, I mentioned it last last night's stream, the one that got existential, and unfortunately the VOD was deleted because I made a boneheaded uh, error. Um, wow. I was I was trying to highlight the um the MGS portion of it, and during the process, the the main VOD was deleted by mistake because oh, I hit no. the wrong button. Yeah, and you didn't like processing, and so you, it never went through. And you didn't have it like recording on the side or whatever. No, I I, uh, I can't do that because that that destroys uh, my CPU. I see. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that sucks. I'm so sorry. Rip. The worst part about it was that I got a cutscene during that during that uh, thing that should not exist. Oh wow! Yeah. I just found uh, someone with Neptunia basis hmm. for a name. How about that? Yeah, I mean, yeah. it happens. Uh, yeah, just that sucks. I'm so sorry, Niall. Yeah, it's it's worse has oh, happened. So it wasn't really yeah. that great of a stream anyway. It, it was really depressing. Yeah. So yeah. like, yeah. Uh, the first half was me playing MGS5 and having some goofy fun with it, and the latter half was just all kinds of depressing, existential, uh, oh no, I've hit walls, uh, yeah. talk, so. Oh. That's a mess. How the f- Oh, I don't- Because he made this on YouTube, so. Yeah. It was my reactions to getting it that was- that made it funny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so, there we go. Do you need me to actually point you towards where the mechanist is, Lemma, or...? Uh, no, I am trying to get through coming to Ishgard right now, and I'm not going the right way. Yeah, sure. No, this will bring me to this map, so... Um, this no, um, it's on this map. Is... Yeah, it's... Oh. Yeah. I need to go up. Oh, boy, yeah. I'll no, figure out my way around this place soon, just... Um... If you need to go up, uh, turn to your right. Sorry, yep. over here. Oh, or uh, up there works, too. Yeah. Ah... Oh my god. You okay, Nick? I got, I got, I got, I got, I have, I managed to get 14 three times in a row on Mini Catpot. Oh, Ouch. red. Oh, <laughs> yes! I, I'm, I, I must have, like, smashed a mirror recently. <laughs> and then I realized it because, no, it's, it's more than just Catpot. Uh, Quill and I, Quill's a really long-term friend of mine, one of the first friends I ever made when I started doing YouTube. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> um, we played Mario Party recently, just, uh, hung out and played Mario Party with, uh, Laser, another long-term friend of mine. Yeah, yeah. And we played Mario Party 3, which is <laughs> notorious as one of the most one of the most nonsense, chaotic yeah. uh, Mario Party games in the entire series. Mm. Um, and I hope your journey was not too Quill in the in the first two turns. No wait, let me re let me rephrase that. Quill in the first three turns got hidden blocks. Oh my god! All... Everyone and two of them were stars. Jesus Christ. Uh, Huh. So, yeah, I mean, it was definitely an experience. Yeah. Uh, I, 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 I wound up getting last. I forgot that I have black Hayate. Over, over on my end, it's going to be a little more chill, because uh, I'm exhausted. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. Aren't we all? Like I'd miss a collab for anything, but oh my god. <laughs> Damn it, Magic, I thought we said I wouldn't phrase it that way. Kyle <laughs> <laughs> uh, destroyed yeah. Azure gonna trigger the cutscene. Yeah, I, yeah. Uh, that's kind of what happened, I will admit, but... Uh, Raising. Thanks for following my friends, Scrapper. <laughs> Scrapper's doing a good job so far. Yeah, doing the Lord's work. Thanks for being our friend, Nikki. Mech Lord? Yay. <laughs> Yay, friends. <laughs> Whoa, friendship. <laughs> I don't know why I went Palpatine on that, but... Eh. <laughs> my, my, my basic works. reaction to thanks for being our friend, Nikki, is just surprise Pikachu face. Friends! <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
friendship, parenthetical, malicious. <laughs> <laughs> Will we continue to be friends after we start the V-Festa? Because yes. we already have, we already, the first job we have in the whole kit is Berserker, so it's yeah. gonna be... That'd be a ride, yeah. Army, so we're not going to be completely each other. Yeah, by the yeah, way, how... at least two people are going to be berserkers. Uh, how do we find out, like, um, what the rest of our jobs are? Do you have to, like, ask them, or...? Um, when we get to the point where we unlock the next set of jobs, uh, there's, okay. like, four major points in World 1. Mm -hmm. So FF5 is two di is a three worlds. Hmm. It's it's the world of light that you start in, and then it's um world of the darkness, and then it's the uh the merged world is the final one where you kind of just can do whatever and yeah. clean up and do clean up and stuff. But yeah. um the first ah. world there are points where you go to the crystals, and that's how you get your jobs. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah, good I tweeted out. Yeah. Oh, good, you're meeting Dad. Hello, Comfy Cat Gaming. Great to see you. Yeah. Uh. <gasps> Comfy Cat? Hi! Oh, yeah. Hi. Yeah, so once, uh, so when we start the challenge, it's at Windshrine, which is mm -hmm. our first job we start with. Um, and we don't get new jobs until we hit Watershrine. So, yeah. up until Water Shrine, we're going to be all freelancers. Yeah. Oh, uh, the Moko Taku, thank you very much for following. Welcome to the network. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Hello, Pierre Aguero. Welcome to the stream. Moko's a really good friend. I love her a lot. <laughs> nice. Would yeah. Moko by chance be the Cosmic Dragon? Yes. Yes, Ooh. that is her. Cosmic Dragon Mama. Nice. Ooh. I just noticed they have follow on Twitter, so I'm assuming that's mm -hmm. who that was. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're gonna be doing the um the EFCO event tomorrow. Ooh, exciting. Uh, oh, very nice, very nice. Very, oh, very what class. Nice. What class is the character for that, by the way? Like assassin or ranger or archer? I really doubt the FACO classes nowadays. Mm. Um I think Nagao, Nagao's Lancer. That's it. Okay. That'll be a yeah, fun addition, so, Like, I, I got, I got Ku, but I want Nagao. What I, who I really <laughs> want is Artoria Lancer, because I'm a massive Artoria simp, but yeah. I won't be able to get her into, like, two or three more chapters in. And I'm not taking the game seriously at all, so. Mm -hmm. Which is fair. Yes, Zion, you are in fact here. I can you see are you. You are indeed here, Yeah. You're right there. Wow. Welcome, Ziona. What a surprise. <laughs> you are present. I mean, it's nighttime. Ziona's allowed to be awake. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Don't worry about the Yeah, I'm, I'm exhausted, but I'm just in a chill in FF14, because <laughs> that's how you yeah. normally do. <laughs> the dark moon has risen oh. once again. <laughs> Uh, speaking of, uh, welcome, Moko. Moko, talk you to the freezer. Hopefully, you're having a good night so far. <laughs> the freezer. Yeah, I'm yeah, a cryogenic that's... robot, so. Yeah. Oh, sounds chilly. <laughs> it's lovely yeah, that way. That's a, that's a good way to put it. Spit nippy, yeah. <laughs> oh, for the record, am I allowed to explain what I have planned for that for that uh, Android thing I mentioned? Oh, uh, if you want to, yeah, by all means, yeah. As long as it's within TOS, yeah. Well, yeah, well, of course. <laughs> so I've, been, I've been discussing it. <laughs> well, it's probably more TOS than my current avatar is. <laughs> um, or so I should hope, anyway. Very high, yeah. very high waist, high hip uh, leotard outfit, but mm -hmm. it covers the booba, so uh, there's yeah. no rules against the hip, is there? No, I don't but think the, so. The general premise is that I've explained it with Lemma and, and Nikki already, but I was going to be doing a second character as well that I do probably less often than Mama mm. Nile, purely mm. because I wanted to make a way that I could do things to step out of my comfort zone. I've mentioned before that I don't like streaming or uh, playing visual novel type games because they can only hold my interest for so long, and mm -hmm. if I'm being perfectly honest, I'd rather go read a book. Like, yeah. it's just, I'm, I'm essentially watching a voice, I'm essentially watching still images talk to each other, yeah. narrated while reading a book that might that gives minor endpoints every so often. 
for any yeah. book, rather. And I'm like, I don't know how I can sit there and do that, but that I thought to myself, if I'm going to be doing that, I may as well make an alternate persona for myself that would make sense. Yeah. And I have mentioned before that I have like this whole near automata AU type of verse mm -hmm. where this mm -hmm. entity from human era is reawakened and rapidly evolves into a what the Yorha think is a dangerous self-evolving entity that is able to convert normal machine life forms into really badass right cyber animals. Take yeah. your time, Nikki. And the entire premise for the character is that after that whole ordeal is solved and Yorha and this entity like figure out, okay, you're fine, just just don't don't be an ass. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The, the, the entity who eventually goes by either Cyber Dragon, Infinity, or Nova, depending on what name you want to go with. I haven't really figured out a name for the character yet. CDI. On that because calling her CDI <laughs> is a bit unfortunate, yes. <laughs> 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 she has a lot more processing power than that. <laughs> so, uh, further, down, further down the line, the character develops what is essentially the AU machine from Fate Grand Order. Because she realizes this future where humans, well, spoilers for anyone who may not know Near Automata, um, she doesn't want to live in a post-apocalyptic universe where only shitty machines at war with each other exist. Yeah. However, she realizes she fair. can't change that. So everything's dead and gone already. So she's like, okay, at the very least, I want to develop a method to contact the past to prevent them from suffering this horrible fate. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, so she develops, or manages to, to somehow develop, an AU machine that is essentially a phone call to past timelines and even similar timelines. So for, like, for Fate Grand Order, the whole premise is we developed this machine because we figured out that a hundred years down the road, humanity will no longer exist. So we gotta figure out a way to stop that, and we created a machine that we can essentially... Uh, put our mind. It's it's like quantum leap almost. Yeah. It's really weird. They just like they have their like an avatar of themselves sent back to the past so, so they can affect a singularity to prevent, prevent catastrophe. Okay, fair yeah. enough. So that is what uh, Nova does in hmm. that she develops this thing with the help of a friend that she made, and she essentially then realizes, well, while I'm doing this, I may as well learn what humans were actually like. And so and streams. And yes, and then apparently just begins streaming various things that she would find relevant to yeah. understanding what human life was like. Yeah. Unfortunately for her, that may that may very well include um, gotcha games, and I don't think <laughs> that's a good way to start understanding humanity's mindset. But yeah, oh, it, is. it is. Yeah, uh, sadly. And of course, I had planned to say, oh, the first thing I could do with her was a stream girls frontline. And I would, I was also gonna mention. I'm not, Lemma. Do you mind if I mention this as well? What I mentioned to you the other night, how it's like I planned that potentially, yeah. uh, the first person she ends up contacting, aside from my own handler, was you. Yeah. No. no, no. In some capacity, like, and it, it was by happenstance and yeah. mistake. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. No. But by all means. Feel free. To, no. Like, just Nikki's busy right now, but like, I'm gonna say this. Feel free to insert me into your lore. Nikki's already done it a fuck ton. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like the premise was that, of course, like because again, it's like a timeline mishmash of just yeah. she accidentally contacts one of my one of our bot buddies here, and once she establishes that contact and has it consistent, she figures, can you help me understand humans and what they were like because they don't exist in my timeline. Yeah. I was made by them, but due to catastrophe, they're all gone, so I can't yeah. possibly know, but I harbor all of their memories and all their best, all their best, uh, traits, so I want to know why I'm meant to be this arc. Mm -hmm. And their games are played, eventually she understands, but I'd be using a, a voice synth, and yep. as well as a different tone to my voice, I'm gonna yeah. try and, like, remain stoic in sound yeah. and that's going to be challenging for me but if you yeah. want i mean makes sense method yeah. in the voice acting makes sense makes sense very cool yeah and uh -huh. method acting is always kind of yeah. oh, fun to uh, try out anyway so yeah 
Ooh, couple messages I missed. Uh, Captain Cat Gaming cries about how much I love Fish Guard System. It is very pretty. And Scrapper, I have a question. What is the network exactly? It's the network of folks I know and talk to and hang out with. Yeah. The space that Lena exists in. Yeah. Alright, um... Okay, so... Uh... The, um... The... Machinist's, um, acronym is MCN, right? MCH. MCH, yeah. okay. None of this equipment they're offering is good for either Black Mage or Machinist. So, fine. Well, you'll fi be looking for aiming gear, which is usually <laughs> tied with hard stuff. Yeah, yeah, just like, um... Yeah, just like, um, uh, none of them had either Bard or Machinist or Black Mage. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, oh, gotcha. okay. we get the aiming and casting stuff in this one, okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh boy, we get, like, the, uh, the, like, jester hats. Yeehaw. Yeah. Yeehaw, that's gonna be my first piece of machinist gear. Excellent. You get Why? the lovely sets of light armor. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I remember as well that you start at level 30 with machinists. So, oh, 30? But yeah. it's right. worth yeah. it. it. It's, it's, yeah. I would say, unironically, it's probably the best ranged physical DPS. Mm hmm. I mean, they if you're. Significantly enhanced it. Yeah. Yeah, and if you're tossing between, what is it right now? Bard, Machinist, and Dancer? Mm hmm. Yeah. Like, I, I have Dancer, and I got the 80. I like Dancer. It's just that it's not really damaging. But it's aesthetic as all hell, so I yeah. can appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. Bard yeah. is just, you are hitting the same button over and over again, waiting for other things to proc. And I'm like, I can't play this class. I tried. <laughs> I Delicious. got a on one of my characters, and then I'm like, uh-uh, I'm done. Yeah. I can't do this anymore. Yeah. Dancer's good for making everyone else do huge damage. Yeah, sounds it. Yeah, because you get, like, a self buff that you can apply to one other person as well as a couple uh, others, so... Yeah. It's helpful in that sense, and Bard does do various buffing to the party as well. Machinist is more so about damage. God, it says Gaja affects all timelines. <laughs> You're right. I am fucking suffering. It's, in which sense? It's eighty-two. Black mage. It's eighty-two degrees outside, and I don't have a fucking AC. Oh no! It's gonna be ninety tomorrow. Rapid overclock engage. Oh, God. I might, like, need to step away to, like... Yes. I might need to step away at some point just to get something cold, but yeah. That's fair. I, I do have nothingness on this character, too, don't I? Okay. Yeah, 27. That's pretty hot. Yeah, I do. Oh, wow. I never really configured anything for it, though, huh? Yeah. Oh, did you switch characters, or...? No, I, I'm I'm on Mitsuki still. Huh. I'm just I just forgot that I do have Mechanist on this character. Who is? Oh wait, uh, Com Comfy Cat Gaming, you're Cavatina, right? <laughs> yes. Ah, yes. yes they okay. Are. Join us. There. <gasps> yeah. Mm -hmm. Hello. Oh, that Welcome. makes me happy. Yeah. It's been a while, Comfy Cat. How's it going? Oh, jeez, right. I'm back. Welcome, Welcome back, back, Nikki. Everything good? Welcome back. Yeah, everything's fine. <clears throat> Bother me. Oh. Uh. The placement of that heat gauge is making me cringe. Fun. <laughs> yeah, uh. Oh, you can move it pretty easily, so. Oh, Lord. Size, it's... <laughs> What's up, Nikki? Ah, uh, the mock up. Ah. <laughs> uh. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hi, it's been a very weird few days. Yeah. Uh, Which is fair. Uh, admittedly, the mock-up, it's not my first time doing that. I actually did that before with a couple other characters, but I'm very happy that so far the artist that I have, which is also a kind of a friend of mine because we've I've mm -hmm. gotten several things from them before, uh, they're they're currently trying to trying to figure out how it works. Yeah. Um, but I, I, and that, that's the hard part is that this is the first time this character will actually be visibly yeah. seen. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <clears throat> yeah. By the way, yeah, yeah. Like, just when you, like, yeah, if you ever get around to, like, having the money for a rep sheet or whatever, 
I've got a recommendation of someone who, one, does, like, relatively, really cheap ref sheets. I really don't care. Yeah. Two, is good at drawing chubby characters. And three, is also good at drawing robots. Yeah. Is it, is it Captain Bragg? It is Bragg, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they are. Well, I, I, ironically, this character is not chubby, but they can totally huh. be made chubby. Because they, they have, because, one, again, I mentioned before, their primary ability is the assimilation and redistribution of biomass. Yeah. Because that uh, was like what they were designed hmm. for initially. They were yeah, like, oh, yeah. this is this thing is going to be like a small serpent-shaped entity that can gather up, you know, biological material and evolve itself to grow like limbs or wings mm -hmm, mm -hmm. temporarily to get around terrain. And then when those limiters were broken, when she woke up like 9,000 years later, she then rapidly became a massive dragon with huge wings. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Because, Hi, because it was like she was targeted and wanted to be killed by Yorha, so she was like, "Okay, uh, I'm gonna become something that can't be that kids can't be stabbed." Wait, Tataru is old enough to drink? Yeah. Yeah. To swallow cells, they're just short. They're not young. Fair. <laughs> just like they're actual gremlins. Yeah. Just like. <laughs> yeah. I thought like. I thought like a lot of the folks in uh, in the science were like on the younger side. No, Tataru's Tataru's basically yeah. Kieran. Just yeah, Alpha no yeah, I thought at least Alpha Note and Minfelia, but Yeah, no, just Alpha and Alpha. Okay. Just the two elf yeah, sisters. Minfilia... Elf twins. Yeah. Minfilia's not young. Minfilia uh, yeah, yeah, is no, like yeah. late twenties, early thirties. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tataru is basically Kieran though. I don't know who Kieran is. Uh the Ram Droid. I think we've raided them once in the past. Possibly. My memory is not great right now. That's fair. Oh. Uh, you may not remember I said something in the day about a rebrand. I'm able and willing to reveal a little bit. Two words. Cowboy Coyote. Tutter, uh, yeah. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, Tudor is the only one. There's a lot of cowboy YouTubers, yeah. actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. I actually worked on a commission for a cyborg cowboy VTuber, like, not too yeah. long ago. Just, it's, uh... Gener it's generally on tap. Yeah, just like, uh, Penny is gonna be a bit busy for a little while, so they won't be able to stream just yet. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. yeah. They were kind of asking me about that earlier today, about what they were supposed to do with the VRM, so they're kind of oh. looking into it now. Yeah. Yeah, just like, uh, their deployment, um, apparently got moved up. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gonna be a bit quicker, so Penny's gonna mm -hmm. be a little bit busy with basic yeah. training and all that. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Just waiting on close to be made at this point. Well, best of luck. Close? Mm -hmm. close, close can be a little complicated. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Tataru is, honestly, I re I like Tataru. Tataru deserves better. Oh, yeah, she does. Ta Tataru is, Tataru is the least deserving of what happens. Yeah. That's oh, really geez. true. She's she's sure. the best. She's the best Pokéto. She very much is. One of the few good ones. Yeah. The, there are some not all not all Pokétos come out of the ground spoiled. Yeah. <laughs> uh, only all only the ones in uh, yeah only the ones in Ulda. Yeah, all the ones in Ulda are horrible. Yeah, like Jesus Christ. Especially especially ones with the sinister like. The fucking. Facial hair. Yeah, the ones with like the what is it? The Tarzan. Yeah. The the the, the Tarzan poacher mustache. Yeah. <laughs> that is what it is, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, we need money. <laughs> Just money. Supplier <laughs> currency. Uh. Yeah, uh, <laughs> the only good Lala fell in Ulda is Pippin. Yeah. Pippin, yeah, Pippin's I mean, good. The, I mean, there used to be another good Lala fell in Ulda, but, well... There used to be. Something happened to her. Ahem. 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 Uh, if man. you want to know what happened to her, check out the video of me watching what happened to her with Niall 
cheering me on. <laughs> yeah. Also, uh, be sure to play Final Fantasy XIV. Did you know that there's a free trial available that lets you play through all of Morale Reborn and Heaven's Word while also progressing up to level 60? Including that portion of the story? Yeah. Yeah. News. So you too can... So you too can cheer on people getting absolutely murdered to wipe the timeline clean of all Popatos for two years. God. Because <laughs> I do need to reiterate, you don't see other, you don't see other Lalafell you don't see other Lalafell to that degree like you used to. No, they're usually sword. saved for like the class skills and stuff. Yeah, it's almost exclusively Elizabeth. Mm -hmm. And Humes. Yeah, I see. And, uh, yeah, it's just fortunately for us. Yeah, at some point I should probably do Saucer, and then I do actually have a couple um, uncleared things to do. Honestly, if this were an ad, Square Enix couldn't pay me enough. Yeah. I, can, I can advertise FF14 all I want, but the E3 conference they had yeah. was not great. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just... Oh, shit, there's two MSQ things to do. Okay. Yeah, yeah they, um, they kind of have, like, they have, like, branching yeah. MSQ so, now. Yeah, I've got a couple uh, things that I need to do at some uh -huh. point. There's yeah. a person with the username of Jalapeno Pepe. And I don't know how to feel about oh, that. Oh, God. That's a, that's a spicy Pepe. Yeah. I heard you're allowed to feel uncomfortable. I'm, I'm going to be I'm gonna be looking through names in Verdania. Yeah. Uh, Ken, Ken Lena Meow Mix. Yeah, so... Nice. Yeah, I unlocked a couple things off screen that should... That I might want to do at some point. So, okay. there's Zemail Darkhold. Okay. And... The Battle on the Big Bridge. Yes. Battle on the Big Bridge. Yes. <laughs> I feel like Battle. I don't remember that one. Um, that's um, that's part of the Manderville quest line. Um, yeah, Battle on the the Battle on the Big Bridge is <laughs> the is the FF five throwback. Yeah. You know what? That's what I can do today because I haven't actually started Manderville on this character. I haven't done Manderville oh, yeah. on this character either. I'm gonna do that. Yeah. To little uh, amigo. Yeah, to uh, for a fate. Comfy Cat has um, cringed at the mention of Zemail Darkhold. <laughs> it's, it's not too bad. I, I literally, like, I always wonder, like, 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 which is worse, Zymal or uh, or Orum Vale? Because Orum. with Orum Vale, it's like that first room is probably the primary thing that's awful about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I don't really have any problems with Darkhold, in all honesty, so Orm Vale is just worse because there's nothing yeah. inherently wrong with Darkhold yeah, by my yeah, standards. Darkhold, like, Darkhold just takes a while. Yeah, yeah, it yeah really the, first, the first boss is a little bit obnoxious, but the, the weird thing is that that, that big crystal buff really helps oh, the tanks for big pulls. You can literally pull everything in the first in the first area and stand in the crystal mm -hmm. and be fine. Mm -hmm. So yeah, yeah, that's kind of what most people do anyway, so I know that's why I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Um and hi little star, welcome to the stream. Ooh, now we wait here for fate. <laughs> I I know this isn't Final I, I know this isn't uh, Fallout 76, but I do have 40 hours in Fallout 76, so, so cut me a little bit of slack. Discard and Sea Clubs, okay, so. Alright, that's a couple things I need to travel to, so before I do that, I'm gonna go do Gold Saucer quick. Fair. The homoeroticism of dancing with a friend while both of you are dancers. Good. Ah, uh, yeah. That's about normal. I just. Plus, I mean. I just realized that it's called the Manderville Gold Saucer. Yeah. Yeah. Of course they run it. Is it? It it, it oh. is two is two and two making five now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, you'll get like the part in the quest line soon. Yeah, it's just like, why didn't I connect the dots earlier? It makes perfect sense. <laughs> oh, I got messages I missed out on. Mocha says, uh -oh. speaking of other characters, I may try to dress up the lore for my black hole version and how she came to be. 
Oh yeah, because we discussed uh, that, didn't we? Yeah, so I, I, we were, Amoka and I were making jokes last night about like, oh, what's your alter version? It's like, oh, for me, I you know, a cyber dragon, essentially. But then I mentioned like, and Mocha's like, what would mine be? And I, like, I have an answer for this. You're Cosmic Dragon, Mom, right? So I grabbed pictures of the fan art that people made of the, of the very first image of the black hole that came out a few years ago. Mm -hmm. And I was like, that, you'd be that. And she goes, oh my god, oh, fucking, that's actually pretty yeah. good. <laughs> uh, fucking black hole, Gajinka. She's, uh, the, yeah. uh, well, I, okay, I was gonna say something, but I just realized I probably shouldn't say it that I, way. I, I, I totally forgot that the Manderville quest line is basically a is basically a Yakuza quest line that got lost. Uh, yeah, <laughs> basically. That is yeah. a really good description of. I never finished it. I did like the, the first part where it's like the introduced. Oh, hey, there's another inspector. And then yeah. there was like that bit of the, the Shadow Man, and then that that's where you I went up until you got the. Two. You went up until you got the Manderville, basically. I guess so. I think. Do I, wait, do I even have that emote now that I'm thinking about it? I have to look now. Or is that be placed under? Would that be under? Um, special? it's M dance. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. I, I have, I have the Mandeville dance. I don't have the flex with the with the two sparkle. Yeah, I don't have that yet. I never finished it because I was like, I can't handle this. This is too stupid. Yeah, it's spectacular, <laughs> but Jesus fuck. Have you, I, I assume that you've already met his dad. Yes, the goldsmith. And yes, the man who okay. absolutely refuses to wear clothing. Oh, early. Yeah. I mean, why would he need to? <laughs> uh, Muscles like these, nothing fits. <laughs> <laughs> you want to yeah. Shut that, buddy. The Stormblood yeah, stuff with, uh, the Stormblood stuff with the Hilt Brand story is great. Okay, I will get to that at some point. Hopefully. Yeah, the Hilt Brand quest line is great. Yeah. Yeah. Plus, it gives a better dance. Ooh, okay. Oh, yeah. No, the Mandeville is a classic. Yeah. Alright, on to the Falcon's Nest, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Three, four hours left in the 10 hour VOD. Oh, you're getting to the sweet spot. The oh, last boy. four hours of the, the Fallout 26 stream were a trip. <laughs> we, were, we were just vibing at that point. <laughs> This week's Fallout 26 stream shouldn't be as long as that. Hopefully. No promises, though. It's also it's also important to note that the Hildebrand and like the whole Manderville quest line is basically them learning how to use or like learning how to make proper cutscenes. Yeah. Yeah. Just that, that it, aren't that aren't just basic. Yeah, like, just like, and yeah, like hyper exaggerated faces and everything. Like it, mm, it's basically, yeah. it's basically just an F. Um, it's just an SFM, like yeah, all yeah. the way down. <laughs> it really is. It, it oh, is. Boy. Like, have you I seen? I cannot the... wait for you to get the Shadowbringers. Then. Oh boy. <laughs> it gets it gets real good, but real dark. They use oh, the, they boy. use that power for evil. <laughs> oh, oh no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, they, they start really using that power for evil. And in Shadowbringers, they start making you feel. Oh no! With the power of SFM. Ah, uh, horrifying. It's it's like uh, it's it's like one of the best um. It's like one of the best animations of TF2. This is a bucket, dear God. Dear God. There's more. No. <laughs> <laughs> God, I remember everyone making fucking Homestuck jokes about that back in the day. Yeah, I can imagine. It's 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 one of the it's one of the best. Yeah, honestly, that that whole thing is amazing. Mm -hmm. Just because it's just the look on Spy's face that yeah. makes that whole scene. Well, and but, soldiers, but yeah. Yeah, rest in peace. Rest in peace, that man, by the way. Oh, uh, yeah, Rick May, rest in peace. Rick May, oh, Rick May was one of the best. Yeah. Wasn't that the soldier's voice actor that died? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's him, Rick yeah, May. Yeah, I, I did they, hear about that now yeah. that you mention it. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah um, they, they put a memorial, they put a memorial in, I think, two forts. Yeah, or they put a memorial in a few maps, I think. Yeah, but Rick May is, like, one of the defining personalities of the entirety of TF2. Yeah. 
it, it goes, it's, it's soldier, it, it's soldier heavy. Spy scout. Yeah. Spy. Yeah. Those are like Spend, the yeah. big four, I feel. Yeah, then like scout as well. Yeah. F oh, no! Ether currents! <laughs> Yeah. Uh, You're gonna have to learn how to fly uh, now. I uh, think you, you, you do need to do this. The fate just spawned on Galgamesh. Oh, which fate? Uh, what fate? The uh, Hellbrand oh, one. Right, Dapper Zombies. Fate. Yeah. 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 If you need to do the Dapper Zombies for Hildebrand, now's your time. Yeah. Oh, of yes. course, is right in style. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's right. Hang on, I got. I'm gonna have to add a new, a new version of my croc block, but it won't be croc block anymore. It's gonna be something a lot more cursed. Oh no! <laughs> Nikki, I didn't skip ahead once. When I say I watch pause from start to finish, I mean start to finish. Full credit. <laughs> okay. Um. Full, full credit. I excuse yeah. people who skip ahead through breaks, but at the same time, when I take breaks, you should take breaks too. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I am. Which is fair. I'm gonna be back 30 seconds. I'm fucking overheating. I need to get something cold. I'll be right back. <laughs> oh no, I am right here. I am terrified to I am terrified to hear about what Niall's laughing about when I get back. Oh, you're gonna see it, you're gonna hate it. Oh god. Okay. You're gonna hate it. Be right back. Oh yes. Perfect. This is excellent. <laughs> As now Redis, oh, <laughs> the no. latest issue of Boruto. Oh no! <laughs> this is okay. So to give some context, this art piece was done by a buddy of mine, Frank Tonius, who usually draws some weird indoor fetishy things most of the time. But they do some quality shit posts when they do them, and this is probably the best. <laughs> hey, I yeah, know. quality shit posts are handy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> hello, Lizzie. Welcome. Welcome to the cursed stream. Uh, there we go. I've returned, motherfuckers. What the hell did you do, Niall? Nothing to Hang on, I'm, 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 I'm working it. Hang on. Oh no. <laughs> Nothing that wouldn't just... already put the fear of God in you. Yeah, let me just go ahead. <laughs> let me just go ahead and put it at like make it a big picture real quick, <laughs> so you can just get the full context. <laughs> is it on your stream or? Yes, it is. All right. Uh... You want some cursed FF FF14 content? This is your cursed FF14 content. But I will put the picture in the server as well because this needs this needs to be shared. <laughs> there is no way this is going without this is not going on this is going unshared. Yeah. What? <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> Early on, Jay, how could you betray us like this? <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, do you want a voice for that or? <laughs> yes, oh no! Please, do it. Oh god, do it. Do it. <laughs> well, read us thy newest release of Boruto. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, Has dude! Thou read us thy newest release of Boruto. Jesus Christ! Has thou? <laughs> Has thou? Why? <laughs> Why? I mean, Fear not. why not? Yeah. If Nell's gonna have the cursed content, then it's probably for the best, because I know I'm never gonna bring it up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> Look, right, I, so. yeah, I give, I give the cursed content, because I... I'm, it's, 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 yeah. it, it's weird, it's weird because Sundays are, Sundays are slowly becoming the... I want to play FF14, but at the same time, I've been really, really buckling down and playing Devil May Cry, and I want to play Devil May Cry right now. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that's valid though so i mean you're all good there is always yeah. the option that we could well i guess it depends because we are also doing this to help lemma get actually through content <laughs> yeah but... it, it's one of those things where i'll probably log on to ff14 just to help along yeah and just play stuff on the side so i can yeah no that is entirely valid nikki yeah like yeah. we're still like chatting and everything because that so that's fun yeah I'm, yeah, I'm definitely, I'm definitely gonna delete my save file of, uh, DMC5, though, and... Yeah, just play again. <laughs> yeah, uh, sure. there's no, there's no save, there's no save files in DMC5. Yeah, I have, uh, to, I have to, I have to go in and remove the... Yeah. yeah, I should probably, like, just tell y'all what I went to go get. Um, are yeah. people fine with that in chat? Mm -hmm. 
Would you rather I walk around the desert for three hours or play DMC Five? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. I, but yeah, that just is like the difference, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Just like yeah. I, a fucking genius, uh, because I knew a hot spell was coming up. A few days ago, when I went shopping, I got a box of Otter Pops. Oh, good choice. And so, those are. Um, basically, they are just like a tube of little um, plastic tube the juice. Little plastic tubes of oh, like flavored no. sugar water. Yeah, there's a lot of names for them. Oh, Otter Pops is just. And... Yeah, no, I just yeah, found. We call them Freezy Pops, right? Yeah, Freezy Pops. Yeah, yeah. Freezy Pops, Otter Pops. Yeah, just like that sort of thing. I just got like a whole fucking thing of them, so I'm having one of those right now to keep from overheating. Yeah. Mars. All right, I'm just gonna delete my data slot dot bin. See what happens. And then I'm just gonna move so the MP5 and see if I have a thing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The they're, they're usually called like freezies or. Yeah. Uh. The real question, what flavor, um, it came with a lot of flavors. I've got a red one right now, so, so it's either cherry or strawberry. Red. Not actually sure. It, it's, it's cherry, but it, yeah. Yeah. It, tastes, it tastes like a weird mix. Yeah. Not like the coffee or and blue cherry, though. Best. Yeah. Blue, blue ones blue are nice, yeah. For sure. Blue and red, for sure. Or I, I've, I've had too many orange, orange things that are just like, yeah, it's orange. I yeah. tend to like the, like, white or clear ones myself, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there aren't any <laughs> clear ones in the mystery. pack I got, sadly. Oh well. Probably a difference up here as well, then. Oh well. Yeah, no, like, just, I got, like, the brand I got is something like Fun Pops or whatever. <laughs> yeah. Oh, um, I, I actually got, uh, it came up in a conversation because, uh, Niall was playing MTS5. And I was talking about cutscenes. Hmm? But on the topic of the MC5, <laughs> what did you think of the live action cutscene style? Oh, yeah! I did see that! That was fantastic, and I won all the little models and toys they had. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I there's. Lemon, do you, also, Lemon, do you know about the hot. live action cutscenes? No! What the fuck? Okay, so this is a thing that you can buy if you get the deluxe edition of the MC5. You can actually customize your cutscenes. So you can play the production versions of the cutscenes where it's just people doing, like, it, it's live-action cutscenes so that they use them for reference when they animate. Ah, so it's basically yeah. just like a ref, um, a fancy storyboard. Yeah, it's a fancy that storyboard. Is... So they do, like, live-action acting and stuff and, like, uh, green-screened over actors and stuff. But they use, like, little toy figures attached to sticks. I, the I fucking love that. Uh, I should, should I just show that. it? I should show that. <laughs> oh, I have seen that something you can show on stream. Yeah, because it's a thing that you can... It's a thing that I own in in uh, in this. Um, yeah, let me... Let me open... Let me open this up. So, um, again, they have production versions of a bunch of these classic cutscenes. Not all of them. Not all of them, but if you buy the deluxe version, uh, you can toggle the live action cutscenes whenever they're available. Yeah. So you can watch the you can watch the live action cutscenes instead of the in game finals. Mm -hmm. Alright, so um Alright, so do you just uncover the map by exploring now? Yeah. Uh okay. yeah. That was all, that was right. kind of always the case, but uh. Okay. So, Lemma, I have a proposition for you. If yeah. you're really going to be going about doing this, I want you to bring up an Aether map, uh, an uh, Aether current map. Yeah, that'll, that'll save you a lot I can, of time. I can, I, can, I can ferry you around to gather all the ones that are gatherable, but yeah. understand that there will be some that are quest-based yeah. as well. But yeah, no, I'm not and currently I'm looking... Flying... Yeah, no. yeah, I'm just going with MSQ right now. I'm not looking for Aether currents yet. Yeah. yeah. I, I usually kind of save them for when you get the one from MSQ, because you can't really get flying until you get that one anyways, and that's usually the last mm -hmm, one you yeah. get. Yeah. Usually so do like, the hard thing first, because I'm a, I'm a masochist, apparently. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm, yeah. Eh. Right now I'm just doing, like, the MSQ bits of, hey, go to the pike, talk to this person, do this stuff. Um, okay, I need to figure out how to delete yeah. cloud save. 
early I'll content, be your bodyguard, so. then. Hmm? I'll be your dancer bodyguard. Sounds good. Because <laughs> because this is now part of the game where everything will begin attacking you for walking too close. Yeehaw! Yeah. Everything's aggressive now. And welcome to being a black mage. Have fun. Also, don't jump immediately off the cliff when you first yeah. enter oh, yeah. don't that worry. area because <laughs> that cliff you jump off of lands right in front of the cockpit and will immediately kill you. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. I am not going to be a... Yeah, I'm not going to be a black mage for much longer. Yeah. Gonna be, uh, gonna be a woman with a gun. Yeah, I'm gonna have a fucking gun. Yes, that, that's also, that also should be noted, Lemma, is that this game has a general rule of if you are ten levels higher than an, than an enemy, they will not attack you. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. so, once you mm -hmm. get to level 60, these guys won't bother you. Yeah. Dark person. And for yeah. lack of a better pun, you can one-shot them anyway, so. I dance the flex. Alright, I'm gonna get the Rainbow Robe of Aiming because I'm switching over to Machinist very soon, but yeah. Uh, okay, I need to go to yeah. Steam user data and go to the cloud saves. Yeah, I will do Ether Currents later, but As now I just... Should. There it is. Okay, so I just delete. Uh, that could also be a thing that you could do for some of the stream is to level Machinus to 50. Yeah. Or get, get around to doing it so that <laughs> that way uh, you can have a better class, like you can have your, your more favorite class, you know, <laughs> ready and willing to go. Yeah. Okay. That's basically what I've been doing with my um, earlier afternoon streams is trying to get Dark Knight up, so. Mm -hmm. Alright. This way yeah. it's not just all running around needlessly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be FF very 14. interesting talking about FF14 while I'm playing DMC5, but it's going to be fine. So, oh, it'll be easy. Re real quick follow-up for chat. Has anyone here actually played a DMC game? I, I haven't. Want to see... Okay, because I definitely want to just play straight uh, straight DMC5 because it's good. How the um, fuck? How the fuck do you get up there? Uh... Without an Aether Kern or whatever. There, there are the various path, platforms you can get uh, the, the map is the map is honestly terrible at, at yeah. displaying whether or not you can move up things. It's really stupid. Mm -hmm. I think to actually get up on the left cliff side, you kind of need to go up to uh, the yeah. like upper third of the map. Hmm. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Here, this let isn't let gonna see, get me up there. I can find the way up. Yeah. I yeah. I oh, think I. Found I it. Oh. Uh. I, I, I think I found a question mark. Wait, uh, there's a ramp yeah. up at this, but I don't think you can jump that. No, that's not Yeah, it. I think, oh, I think I see on the map how to get there, so, yeah. Yeah, you are now in the hell of layered mapping. Enjoy. It gets worse. Why can't they just have, what, games learn how to use a fucking topo map 20 forever? Yeah. I have played DMC5 a lot. Oh my god. I, DMC5 so, is one of the coolest, coolest games I've played in a while. Really is. Yeah. Ari, the Ari engine is version. so powerful. Yeah, it's it's my favorite version of Nero and my favorite version of Dante for sure. Yeah, yeah I, same. Mm -hmm. like, like I love Wacky Woohoo Pizza Man, and I like how he's still like that here, but he's all he gets serious when he has to be. I like. Yeah. Him. Yeah. Talk yeah. To Grandpa. And I I've heard a appreciate that. Yeah. Uh, go ahead. I've heard a lot of very positive things from a lot of people about DMC5. It's because they get it. Like, <laughs> the, the, the thing is, is when you play DMC4, it's just like, who's this guy that looks like Dante and that I don't get and understand in any way, and it's Nero. And DMC Double May Cry it wasn't received very well, but it wasn't a bad game. Mm -hmm. So they just took no. the version of Dante that they designed and gave it to Nero, which works a million times better. <laughs> yeah. And not just because he's voiced by probably one of the best voice actors of our generation, Johnny Young Bosch. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, um, I'm sorry, I, just... I love Johnny Young Bosch yeah. so uh, much. Nick, yeah, apparently your screen's gone, gone black? black. Uh, it's gone black because I don't have a display. Ah. I, 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 clo I, um, I turned off FF14 because it's still on in the background. Yeah. And I'm about to yeah. kick on... Yeah. I still I'm about to kick on uh, yeah. DMC5. I still swoon over V and Virgil, very valid. <laughs> uh, 
uh, shall I game, shall I change the game or is it separated? Yeah, feel free to change the game. Um, whenever we have to go do dungeon with, um, Dilemma, yeah. we will go back uh, to that. Depending on how long we go tonight, you might not even hit one, actually. Yeah. That's true. Especially because so I'm, I'm like, alive. especially because at some point I'm going to, like, tag over to Machinist or whatever. Like, just, at mm -hmm. most we'll, yeah. like, do, at most we'll do roulette. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. I kind of want to level Dragoon on Mitsuki. I haven't done it's at, the, it's at 60, but like, I don't have anything else to use tombstones on, <laughs> so I figure. That's always an option. There we go. Double Rathalos. I, I, the only thing I turn off in DFP5 is Motion Blur. Everything else stays max. Yeah. But yeah, I, I, I consider that I once tried to play DMC three when it was relatively recent um because mm -hmm. i had only recently got i think it was for the gamecube i think i had it on the game yes yeah it was because i recently got in the gamecube and uh i remember that one of my housemates at the time rented me dmc3 because i saw the box and thought it was cool mm -hmm. I was like, yeah that sounds oh, it's really cool mm -hmm. and then i oh you do the opening cut scene oh i love it immediately I get out into the first actual open area. I'm like, okay, I don't know what I'm doing. I can't do this. I go, I give up. <laughs> yeah. Same, same thing that happened with, with RE4, unfortunately, because I was too young and stupid to understand what was happening. I took ah. three steps, opened the open the inventory, and I'm like, yeah, I, I can't do this. Yeah. These controls are weird. I don't know what I'm doing. I, I give up. Oh. And at that point, Oops. I never really bothered, but I did watch the best friends play all the DMC games and then five, so I was, I'm, I'm content with that. <laughs> oh, that works, crash. yeah. Give me, give me a little bit, OBS just crash. Oh no! <laughs> Rip. Oh boy. Uh, You've got 90 seconds. Yeah. I'll go out there. The struggles of figuring it out as I go along. I can say this though. I think my favorite thing that, that come out of DMC five or being in that I guess like that that mini circle of DMC five fans is uh, easy mode is now selectable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that moment absolutely Ooh. destroyed me. I was yeah. gagging so hard I was laughing. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm gonna need some context. Um, so the best friends, Willie and Pat, were playing all the DMC games in preparation for five. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, they, they, they skipped out on two because two is the one that even DMC five says, <laughs> that does, that's not real. Yeah. Um, they, they write on it so hard. In probably the best way possible, too. Yeah, and my, my the, bad. I the, the overall my joke bad. was that the first real boss fight in that game is against Virgil. Um, mm -hmm. and they had died just enough times up to that point that when they died to Virgil on the first attempt, it, it cut and said easy mode is now selectable, <laughs> and they absolutely lost their shit so hard they clipped the audio. Yeah. <laughs> I was laughing so hard I was gagging. It was, it was honestly amazing. <laughs> yeah. All right. There we go. DMC5 is ready to go. Yeah. Just dies to Virgil once. Hi! Yeah, hi, weakling. <laughs> you have yeah. no power. This is, this is gonna be great. I, uh, I'm not good at DMC. Too early. Yeah, I'm not good at oh. DMC. I'm gonna die a, a, a quite then, a few times. So what you're saying is it's a good game to stream, then? Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm gonna do my best, but I'm not. I I barely know how to play Nero. <laughs> yeah. By the way, Niall, you were talking earlier about like um visual novels and such. Mm -hmm. One thing I found that really works, like for VNs, is reading them out on stream. Oh yeah, I I, oh. I try that. Problem with that is that regardless, I am still just. Like, yeah. my reading comprehension is terrible, and the, my speaking mannerisms talk too fast, mm. and I can't slow down. Understandable. Yep. Oh. So it's, it's, like, it's a weird autism issue. <laughs> oh, oh, I definitely get that. I definitely get that. Hello, yeah. Kay the Robot. Wonderful to see you. So feel free to tell me if I need to adjust audio. I'm going to have to do it after cutscene, though. <laughs> 
Do I have to I jump off? Say that I absolutely adore your 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 welcome messages that you give everyone. You're, <laughs> you're so enthusiastic, and I love it. <laughs> I'm I'm happy to have folks here. Lemmy is adorable. Mm. There is big cute. Yes. Mm. Oh, and hello, oh, Astro Goal Fifty Six. Nice to have you here too. I'm just you know here that, being that... cyber bullied by everyone. That's what we should. You know that could. Yeah, damn it! If I had Cyber Dragon available, that would be that would be a great pun. You are being Cyber bullied because we're all robots. <laughs> <laughs> this is um, just a frozen over ether, right? What? Why can't I? Ad... <laughs> yeah. Uh. No, so no, no. Sorry. <laughs> You're okay. But yeah. Yeah. We we are basically just all gonna be robots at some point. Yeah. Um, yeah. I cannot wait for folks to. Um, find out what I'm doing for uh, 500 followers on Twitch. It's going to be so cool. That'll be fun. Uh, so much money, though. <laughs> it's always the way. That's the shit for- Jude! No way. <laughs> <laughs> this is the way. <laughs> I can multitask. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Hildebrand. I found you some buddy things. Ever even easy mode in the Gweber runs. <laughs> I, I don't know what that means, Lizzie. I need context. I'm not good with remembering things. <clears throat> Alright, another right. aiming oh. thing. Alright, is this fork of the quest line done yet? The forks are kind of decently long. When okay. I mentioned that you're not going to hit a dungeon, it's going to be probably yeah. a, a couple Sundays. Alright, yeah. I keep forgetting that the subtitles are in the language section and not the display <laughs> section. Uh, well, <laughs> in any case, so at least, yeah, like just, if we want to do something tonight or next week, we can do Battle on the Big Bridge, but yeah. Wait, what is that now? I honestly forget. Um, that's, um, that's the trial that is part of the Mandeville quest line. Mm -hmm. I don't even have that trial active. I never did the, I never did the Mandeville quest. Uh, it's only like a couple after you meet the goldsmith, but yeah. Which is kind of just what I'm testing yeah. through right now. Yeah. Comfy, is that just a fucking power armor? That's a boss. Is that a uh, power armor mount? Yeah. That's one of the construct mounts. Neat. I think it's based on construct 7, but I haven't really been able to fetch it myself. It feels like I shouldn't be able to say... Yeah. It feels like I shouldn't be able to safely jump across this um, frozen river in a match attack. But, oh well. Yeah. Mag Maggie is light. It's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Maggie's a good girl. <laughs> Very good girl. <laughs> no, okay, that's the end of this quest line for now. How the freak do I have a silver rat? Mine's a, it's an Azur Rathalos, actually. No, oh, thank you for the good um, sub to Chrissy. It's yeah. added. Mm -hmm. Alright, I am done with this fork for now, because it said the two worst words I want to hear. Join instance. Duty calls. Uh. Yeah. Wow. Uh, Moody Colonel. <laughs> I just got that joke. I get it. I got that reference. <laughs> uh, there we go. And where's the closest? All right, so that is. Yaka. Thank you for the raid. Hello. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, all. Welcome, to, welcome to what is usually. FF night, but since everybody's just chilling on playing DMC5. Yeah. Yeah, how did I read the holy fish? Yeah, that's the holy sea. <laughs> You're playing <laughs> Octopath Traveler. Fish? Interesting. I mean, that'd be uh, a pretty interesting like, dish. The game's being a bit coy with you. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. uh, my name's Nikita. I'm an android that maintains a sanctuary of spirits called uh, New Haven. And I'm currently hanging out with the the Festa crew, just playing FF14, awesome. helping along yeah. with uh, Lemon's MSQ. And oh my god! Well, 
I just got introduced to the Sea of Clouds. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's probably one of the prettiest areas in the game. Yeah. Oh well, my god. Conceived within the second well. Oh, come on. Oh, it's just because the lighting in that one zone made it look weird in tone. The uh, blue is actually <laughs> quite subtle. Yeah. The blue is a lot more vibrant in Monster Hunter. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, I need to play more Mon Hun. It's good time. Which one? Uh, I've only got uh, Rise, Rise, actually. We should play Rise then at some point. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of How people. Game are you? Yeah. Um, I am not. I am very not far in. I um, imagine it's still like one star, two star village, probably. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I am. Yeah, just with how stuff is set up in this apartment, I would not reasonably be able to stream it. Sadly, actually, I might, but uh, it'd be comfortable. It'd be weird just getting it set up. Luckily, there are capture cards that have like zero latency display now, so that's good. I can refer to you to one. It's the one that I bought, but it may be Ooh. a bit marked up because the current world state is shitty. Yeah, uh, yeah, just oh, like hot bread. Yeah, um, like just link it to me, and whenever I have the money, I'll get it. Or if like it's, it's any, like around yeah. or just like, or so, yeah, or just good. like Elgato. Yeah. Oh, you got an Elgato one? All right. Yeah. If you could send it to me as well, that'd be pretty handy. Yeah. I'm yeah. kind of looking for um, one. Um, Rody re recommended that one to me because it was, like, arguably the best out there currently. Mm -hmm. I've got the HD60S. Yeah. I think it's the S, is it? Basically, yeah, like, the only catch with Elgato <laughs> stuff is that you have to use... S. Yeah, the only catch with Elgato stuff is you have to use their, um, their software and everything, and from last time I used it, it wasn't super friendly to OBS and everything. I don't know if that's changed, but... Yeah, it used to be not so it great. Fun. No, it's... It's actually... It, I've never had any issues with it. The yep. only issue that I've ever had with it was for the PS3, but that was because the uh. PS3 is hard is hardware-coded to not yeah. allow streaming via HDMI. Yeah. Because Sony is stupid like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You can that, I don't, I've never had any issues with it. Yeah, like, just... I downloaded the software, but once I got that in, Streamlabs is yeah. fine. Yeah, basically, like, just... Oh. I remember last time I used it, they really wanted you to use their, like, recording and streaming software instead of OBS or whatever. Mm -hmm. It's not like that anymore. I think they stopped caring. I th yeah, yeah, I think... Mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah. A little hard to force. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I will look into that at some point. Yeah. I've... Yeah, I've just been, like... I've never really gotten into Monster Hunter or anything. I've heard people sing its praises for a long time, just haven't gotten around to it before. Which is fair. You have a lot on your plate. Yep. Well, if you'd like one of these days, you yeah. don't necessarily... I mean, we could do it off-stream as well. I could... Yeah, I could either way, you, yeah. I could get you in a call and we could do mm -hmm. a shot, yeah. Yeah, either way, yeah. That'd be fun. Ah. Huh. Just know that it is basically <laughs> grind the game. Yeah, just Not like... Not in the good ways. Yeah, just like, now I can, f like, just... I'm finally actually able to use the TV now that I'm living with, uh, you know, now I, that I'm not living with my, uh, with my, like, genuinely abusive former roommates. Gaslit me all the fucking time. It was so bad. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, I'm just... Bush, I'll assimilate them. Yeah, like, just... Convert them to something better. Yeah. We can always turn them into a toaster. We always need more Yeah, toast. yeah, I'm just really glad that I finally cut them off. <laughs> hmm? Smelt them down into, uh, posable figures. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh... There's a Manderville dance. Mm-hmm. <laughs> then... Yeah, uh, yeah, by the way, Comfy Cat, uh, Rody has requested that we boop you. <laughs> oh, cute noise. Oh yeah, I go bop sometimes. <laughs> There's a redeem for it, too. 
speaking of that, I should now mention that because because Lemma seems to have as much issue with taking compliments as most of us do, um, I'm gonna maybe I'll bring back Fluffy Anarchy one of these days, but it will be exclusively targeted at people I'm collabing with. Oh. Okay. Mm. Um, I had a redeem a while back for like twenty five thousand uh, gilded lapis, mm -hmm. and the reason mm -hmm. why. Because <laughs> he says never gonna collab with Mama again. <laughs> or in the circle, you cannot escape. Once you enter, you cannot leave. Um, but the overall joke is that the fluffy anarchy was more of an injet between myself, Meatball, and Lizzie, Idol Lizard, who uh, decided that like, oh yeah, we should have a redeem for when for us to give you compliments and watch you blush. <laughs> and unfortunately, no one really redeemed it all that often because it was a expensive for good reason, yeah. and b no one got was in on the joke. Uh. So unfortunately, <laughs> it didn't get a whole lot of traction. So I removed it. But then I realized, wait, Lemma has really cute groans and moans of frustration. When hey! Or cute. <laughs> So what if I then bring it back, but it's exclusively targeted to collab partners? Okay. All right. Yep. And of course, that'll be fun. Yeah. All Although right. it may like require a when I have a multi-stream. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Lovable bullying is fun. Yeah. Like oh, Jude, thank you for redeeming Blop. <laughs> <laughs> I like that noise. <laughs> it, it's a very <laughs> good noise, yeah. Yeah, oh, uh. Yeah. Oh, Classic. see you, Comfy Cat. Thank you for hanging out. Yeah. Later. Lizzie, I'm, right. gonna, I'm gonna smother you. <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know what you're currently doing in MSQ, but in about, like, one minute, you're gonna experience true DMC fashion. Oh, boy. <laughs> every yeah, every intro cutscene, every intro cutscene for a DMC game yeah, is I am, off its rocker. Yeah, I am just talking to people right now, so I can, like... Tune into your stream for a minute. Just let me know oh, when. Oh yeah, get 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 ready. Oh it's boy. About to start. Oh no. It's the first cutscene of the whole game, and it's a absolute like ten out of ten animation. It it tells you everything you need to know about the game and the franchise straight up out the gate. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Every every first cutscene yeah. of the DMC game sets the tone. Yeah. That's why DMC three's first cutscene is. Probably the best in the classic. series. <laughs> yeah. Wacky Woohoo Pizza Man! <laughs> <laughs> Jack That's what we call him, man. <laughs> Jackpot! <laughs> I also just love the way he holds his guns. Like, I'm sorry, but that yeah. cross armed thing he does, I can't stop doing it. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. It's so like, good. Usually, when, when I'm in the bathroom and I'm, like, you know, washing my hands afterwards, I'll, like, look in the mirror and do that pose and say jackpot because I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, now I want art of uh, me in, in, in Dante's coat. So oh, my jackpot. fucking God. <laughs> Rock and roll. That's how that work well. Yeah. Nico, is also, Nico is also, like, one of my favorite gives... No, no. Gives yeah. no dams character. Mm -hmm. I absolutely love Nico. She's the best. <laughs> yeah, she's she's cute and I'm gay already. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sorry, chat. I am just watching what is going on here. Uh. <laughs> so, okay. <laughs> uh. All of these thoughts running through my head. head. I know I'm fire things burning red. Frustration is getting bigger. Bang, bang, bang. Pull my devil trigger. Devil trigger. Uh. Oh, I love that. It's like it's such an edgy little song, but but it kicks like so part. much ass. It's yeah, so it's, not as good. it's not as good as. The time has come, and so have I. Jesus Christ! Nero's battle theme from DMC4. God. Hopefully, y'all are doing all right. Welcome to the freezer. We're kind of just in a fourteen collab at the moment, yeah. or roughly fourteen collab. We're kind of just chilling uh, and having fun. But how are you doing tonight? Uh, we're just having fun. Yeah. 
Right. Nero, I love you so right. much. I forgot that Jun Takeuchi did DMC5. <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And he does a great job. Yeah. Uh... <laughs> I kind of like how, I forgot how, like, Nero's kind of moving faster than everyone else, which I really love that implication, yeah. even in slow-mo. Mm-hmm. Even in slow-mo, he's almost normal speed, yeah. and I love that. Yeah. Yeah, no, I definitely want to play DMC5 sometime. Oh, yeah, it's so good. It's easily my favorite. Yeah. Uh, can't be more than yesterday. Yeah. Bigger, oh bang, God. Bang, bang. Pull my devil trigger. God, fucking yesterday. Uh. Bury the light is an absolute bop. Yeah, yeah. I don't own yeah. the virtual DLC, but I will buy it. <laughs> well, I will buy it if it's on sale during the summer deal. Remember the original version oh, of Subhuman? <laughs> mhm. Mm there we go. How the how fuck do I get up so there? Smoothly. What? Smoothly. It's so great. Broke bridges, God. Yeah, oh no, uh, now that uh, Comfy Cat is gone and Niall, you're elsewhere, I don't have anyone to protect me from the mobs. Oh! Come over this, game, this game does not promote smoking or the use of cigarettes. Sure. See <laughs> clouds. There we go. Uh, because they use sort of, uh, they use cigarettes as like a, like a, like a spectacle in yeah. that scene so they have to like practice it just like we're not trying to like influence mm -hmm. people to smoke because it's horrible yeah yeah, oh. but, uh, <laughs> yeah but one of the big design reasons was because uh hideki is very against the idea of smoking and being cool like the whole the whole philosophy behind behind uh dante's aesthetic was you can have a totally cool dude who doesn't drink smoke or swear which is yeah. the yeah. exact opposite of what everyone in the West thinks cool is. Yeah. Yeah, and Nero, right. Nero is like the Western and version of Dante, yeah. because he swears a lot, but mm -hmm. Dante doesn't. Right, but he, he's also a kind of a himbo, which is yeah. what yeah. I can appreciate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nico, on the other hand, like she that. smokes obsessively, but it's not a, like a defining character trait. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, just like, good. I like just, oh, like, you absolutely can just, like, be cool without drinking, smoking, or swearing. Like, mm -hmm. just, like, cishet Western media's cowards. Uh. Okay. Also, I am in the area, so just right, let yeah. me know if you need a hand. Yep. There uh. we go. <laughs> I have a custom emote for that. Don't ask Yeehaw. why. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. Oh, Cheer up, yeah. crew cut. <laughs> God. <sighs> I just, hey, hey I robot, thank you for the follow. Up. Welcome to the spirit. Yeah. Pack. Yeah. Kay is cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kay is a good friend. Yeah. I honestly still think that, uh, that, that bit for, like, the first major, like, the first actual normal boss of the game that isn't, you know, a set piece uh, yeah. for Nero is probably has my favorite cutscene in the game. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or, or, the, my, or the boss intro. Gets a whole-ass ambulance chucked at him, and he walks out of it after it impacts the wall. Somebody call a doctor? I love <laughs> how much of his uncle he's become. I God. love it. <laughs> Spectacular. <laughs> God, very nice. Very nice. No small talker monologue? Get right to the point. Yeah. <laughs> The motorcycle, though. Can we talk about that for a second? Yeah. Uh, thank you. <laughs> I need you to die. Uh, probably at some point I'm gonna run into a duty cause along this storyline as well, at which point I'm just gonna... You will. Yeah, I'm just, at that point I'm just gonna say, time for me to go become a mechanist. <laughs> Machinist, yeah. Just like, when I don't want to, like, just, I'm just so fucking tired of running duties as a black mage. Like, what the fuck? It's bullshit. <laughs> it do be like that sometimes, yeah. Welcome to the suffering that is black mage. Yeah. Yeah, 
you want to keep the mage aesthetic and also have a very fun and really cool uh, plot for for um for class, you can pick up red mage too. Yeah, I might pick and up. I highly recommend yeah, red uh, mage. It's you start at level yeah. fifty and it's really good. Yeah, I might pick up red mage at some point too. With just robots. Oh, yeah. I almost fell off. Ah, you can't fine. fall off here. There, there's oh, nothing okay. to fall off. Hooray, invisible walls. Mm-hmm. Only invisible walls until you're until you're able to fly. Right. Yeah, I mean the the preface is, is that I'm not really good at DMC. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not yeah. I'm not good at spectacle fighters. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I'm learning. I learned from DMC four how Nero's stuff works in the first place. Mm -hmm. Well, you say that, but with his new arms, they do vary a lot, and they each have their own gimmick. Yeah, they do have their own gimmick, but what really, what really confused me about DMC, like Nero's gameplay, was always Red Queen. I never oh, quite sword? understood the XE mechanic. Yeah. The 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 revving of the sword that's like just yeah. basically gunbreaker logic. I love it. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Hello, Penny. I Good have to a see you. Attached to the game. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to talk okay. over you when you're introduced. When you're you're okay. saying hi to someone. I'm sorry. It's all I'm no. You are tonight. just fine. Okay, so, where the fuck is? There the fuck is? Is it? No, it will not let me because the game is a coward. coward. Yeah. Good to see you, Kenny. It's weird doing all right. I, I, I'm thinking about how it's like, oh, you can be cool and interesting without swearing, and then yeah. I thought to myself, so compared to Mama Nile, I figure that uh, Nova will probably be incredibly say-so by comparison, despite mm -hmm. her attire, which is like <laughs> yeah. a very hip-exposed outfit, and she's yeah. basically bare-legged. Which, uh, <laughs> I mean, oh! People like hips and thighs. Yeah. Oh, and Internet Worm, good to see you! Hi! <laughs> it's Biolante, but flesh instead of plant. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know, I, I now realize why that why that particular enemy that um, Nikki is fighting reminds me, or what it reminds me. It reminds me of that one oh, uh, God, shoot yeah, this God. thing boss from Dead Space One. Ooh. That's outside, and you gotta shoot it with some. Uh, oh, the final boss, you mean? No, not, not, not mm. the final boss, the one that's on the ship that you gotta protect oh, yeah, yeah. with the ADS cannons. I just w got back from page that went out over eight hours ago. Jesus! <laughs> I think that's one of my favorite bits from Dead Space, though. Uh -huh. like, I came to realize on my Redux stream, wait, it's called the ADS. Guys, we gotta turn ads on. Quickly, <laughs> we gotta turn the ads back on. <laughs> like, oh, damn it. What a yeah. great pun, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, uh, been forever missing in. Yeah, hope you're doing okay. Yeah, I'm doing great right now. Uh, I am playing Final Fantasy D14. I've got some very cool friends hanging out on call. Yeah, so like. She has a Power Wheels motorcycle. <laughs> 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 it's just a fucking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I try not to call it that, and it is like, uh oh, I can't, I can't be producing, I can't be, uh, you know, saying join a cult on Twitch. You can't say that, but then it's like, well, I mean, nah. is that, isn't that what VTubing is to an extent? Oh uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. What is this motorcycle for ants? <laughs> <laughs> she straight up stole like an eight-year-old Christmas present. <laughs> Oh, fucking Zoolander. Hey, I get good air on that thing, so. <laughs> the motorcycle. So basically, I'm small. Yeah, no. Uh, yeah, no. Jude is our resident um, mad because small here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm usually the Lolithel or Dwarven characters in any kind of game just because I'm kind of tall normally. Yeah. So I like playing the short characters. Yeah. Mad Wait, because you small. Have you gotten the Shadowbringers yet? Sorry, say that again? Have you gotten the Shadowbringers yet? I have four characters there, yes. <laughs> okay, cool. So you know, you know about the actual dwarfs, then. Excellent. Yeah. 
Yeah. Lolly freaking ho. <laughs> yeah. Lolly ho. Mad yeah. because small. Jealous of tall. <laughs> God, <laughs> such a great video series. Y'all, like, just, if you, if either you've played FF14 before or don't care about getting spoiled on FF14, you've got to watch the Mad Because Small series. It's just good. Please do. Please. <laughs> they are, they are excellent. They are so fucking it is, good. It's, it's like the ideal I method to go about learning of FF14, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe this hooded figure stole my arm. <laughs> Soul. <laughs> it's uh. such a good scene, too. Yeah, uh, Great cinematic work. Uh, I donate my kite to anyone who wants. Nice. Yeah, ah. Uh. Ah. <laughs> uh. There we go. I'm taking your legs back. Yeah. I did begin playing, so I guess I'll see. Yeah. Yeah, Mad Because Small is basically just like, someone decided to make the smallest lolafell possible and then give them very angry eyebrows, and it makes everything <laughs> spectacular. <laughs> And then, like, the uh -huh. deepest, almost snake voice. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> small. Small, 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 small. Angry. Angry. Very, very angry. <laughs> Mad because small. <laughs> uh. The sad part is I end up making my lolafels the tallest they can possibly be, <laughs> and you can still see how small I actually am. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I just, I, I still think my favorite thing about the LFL is the, is the mount scaling. It's like, your yeah. Power Wheels motorcycle killed me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah uh, fantastic. I want to get, yeah, I've heard, I've heard that there's a current, like, fate or raid or something to get a motorcycle, and some of my friends have been going through hell for it. Yeah, pretty much. Is there one? Wait, really? Um, I remember at least, I think I remember, like, Rody talking about it or something. Well, it's some mount that they've been trying to grind for. Mounts are mounts are dr mounts drive the entire end game economy. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Because that and the, by the new time you actually there. hit the mount. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, basically, it's mounts and stuff that makes you look like two B, and that is the end game economy. Yeah. Like your pee your hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I. You're not wrong. Oh. Uh, Flores, thank you very much for the raid. Hello, everyone. I am Lemma. I'm a robot VTuber who both makes and plays games on stream. Hope you all have a good time here. I am hanging out um, with some wonderful friends of mine who you should go check out. There is Nikki Resol, Jude Cryoby, and Wanamiko Nile. They're all cool. I really like hanging out with them. Y'all should toss them a follow. Yeah. Always welcome to have folks hanging yeah, around. Uh, I like the oh, idea of someone just, just chucking a follow button at me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Ooh, you were playing Darkest Dungeon. Fun, fun. Okay. Gotta go through all of the DLC arms now to get ready to do this cutscene <laughs> seven oh, times. Right, you're looking for the spring thing? It's over here. Ah, alright, thank you. I will try and keep up with you, but your motorcycle is very small and very fast. GP01! <laughs> I dropped a lot of weight so I go faster than all of you. <laughs> GPO1's not a Gundam reference, is it? Probably is. Oh, I love, I love the fork one. <laughs> the pasta breaker! <laughs> <laughs> I love yeah. that! Thank you. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Spectacular. That's good. Okay, but the real question is, do you have the, the vibe on- Yes, you do! Yeah. <laughs> I, bought the deluxe, I bought the deluxe edition. Surrender! <laughs> <laughs> I kind of love it, it if you know what I'm saying. Just, yeah, it just, wouldn't, be, it. wouldn't be a Capcom yeah. game without, make, without the Mega Buster. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny because apparently that, that is the worst arm in the game, but people use it anyway because it's hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's, actually, it's actually really funny. People have people have done challenge runs with it because it's so bad. I absolutely, I absolutely just love the idea that Nico's like, hey, you ever, th you ever think about, you know, utilizing your your, your, your arms for, for, for benefits beyond fighting? He was <laughs> like, wait, what are you talking about? I think there's a challenge huh? run of no upgrades. Yeah, there's a challenge run of no upgrades. Dante must die in Mega Buster. <laughs> it's really funny. <laughs> uh, Dante definitely seems like a good series to challenge run through yeah. pretty much yeah. everything. Um, okay. Hey, sweet fruit I also, crystals. 
I, I am also just like really anticipating the bit where you get to the 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 one Cerberus fight because I love watching that cutscene for the weapon that he gets from it because it is literally one to one what it was in DMC three and I absolutely love that spectacular. That makes yeah. me so happy. <laughs> hey, I remember a smelly little pooch just like you. It's like yes, <laughs> he makes the reference. It makes yeah, me so the happy. Whole game. The whole game is just full of references. Yeah. There, uh, there's a cutscene. There's a cutscene involving Dante that has not aged at all. Oh no. Yeah, oh boy. That's a good sign. Oh no. What's the reference Wait, which to? Which one is that? Um, they, he, uh, Nico get Nico gives him a fedora. Oh, oh my yeah, god. Yeah, and, he does, and he does it. And he does it for <laughs> to Michael Jackson. Oh my fucking yes. god. Uh. <laughs> Oh, I Only love that one so much. It's, and it, apparently it's, it's also a really good weapon, too. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. very tastefully done. <laughs> it is a trilby that fires meteors. Yeehaw! Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's, it's a trilby, that's right. Oh, I mean, it makes sense. Yeah. I mean, is it any worse than fucking... Uh, I mean, trilbies are worse it's, because it's, people it's, pretend it's, they're fedoras. Yeah. Trilbies well, are just better like, fedoras. People don't know what hats are. Yeah. What are hats? Have people not played TF2 before? Because, because yeah. see, here's the thing, though, is that what what um, Dr. Alan Grant in Jurassic Park and what uh, Indiana Jones wears, those are fedoras. Yeah. Trilbies, on the other hand, are that cringy internet come at me bro hat. Yeah. And people always think they're fedoras <laughs> because they're in the same classification of hat, but it's a different shape. Yeah. But no one wears hats like that. Unless you're cringy or yeah. doing it ironically. Yeah. Or a period actor. <laughs> yep. So, I mean, uh, I mean, honestly, though, it's, I'd rather uh, wear a tricorn. I don't like hats. Have any idea how hard it is to wear a hat with horns like mine? <laughs> don't yeah. work. <laughs> I like hats don't work. more so, so. Mm -hmm. uh, need to move out of there. I'm one of those people that, like the, that likes the idea of wearing the headphones, but it's like the 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 part that's supposed to go on top of your head, it sits behind yeah. your head. Yeah. Uh, there's fedoras and then there yeah. There's fedoras and then there's fedoras derogatory. <laughs> <laughs> that's the oh, best. Okay. I love yeah. it. Yeah, thank you, Worm. <laughs> worm? Yeah, Internet Worm, uh, one yeah, of worm. Yeah, my chat members. Yeah. Where'd you go? It's spelled W-Y-R-M, like the dragony creature. Oh! Mm hmm Okay, you know what, can I ask a question now? Are any of you the kind of person that does that, the whole, uh, I define what type of dragon this is by calling it the classification of its body type? Not really. Yeah, always. Yeah. All right. I, I do that because it's it's actually a cool method yeah. of like categorizing is, yeah. the species. Because mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you have like you know alligator, crocodile, gharial, caiman. They all are physically distinct. Yeah. Some more subtle than others. Looking at mm -hmm. you, fucking gharial, you weird ass <laughs> snoop. Yeah. I don't know what happened to you all. I'm your mother, and I'm sitting here like, what did you what did you do? What, how mm -hmm. did you do this? Yeah. And um, like I I like the idea of wyvern oh, you know okay. exclusively yeah. referencing the bat body type mm -hmm. wing yeah. for arm legs yeah. probably poison in some capacity right mm -hmm. and i remember reading somewhere that wyverns don't breathe fire and i'm like i like that idea but i think monster hunter says we're not doing that <laughs> okay well how the fuck do i get to be a machinist all right uh, so nice you got sky steel manufacturing all right, sky steel yeah because i've Run into the duty calls for both of the branches, so it's time to become a class that doesn't suck. <laughs> That's a mood. So is it fair to say I can soft a black mage then? Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> Rathalo says, I'm a Over here, Lana. Lana, back here. Hmm? Oh, uh, the other bubble, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I was going to the wrong bub- um, the wrong, like, quest bubble. Yeah, that's why I just wanted to turn you around. Thank you. I had this idea this for a while that I observed the Xeonet armor, but instead of plate mail and a spear, it's a plate carrier and an SVD. Do it. Ooh. Yeah. Do it. Yeah. SVD. Yeah, it's, um, 
It's a Dragonov. Oh! I ate the Dragonov. Yeah. That's, uh, that's just sure. Leona's favorite I firearm. Sure. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Oh, that's actually, you know, okay, that's a weird question to ask, but now I'm curious. What's everyone's favorite non-fictional firearm? Non-fictional? I have to specify non-fictional because everyone's going to say the same fucking answer, let's be honest. The P90 oh, looks not, cool. Not me. The P90 looks cool in, as shit, and, yeah. Oh. It, the P90's a classic. If the uh, GFL has taught me anything, the AK-999, just because I tend to like tank buster rifles. You know what? That's a, that's <laughs> AK-99. Yeah. That's my wife yeah. right there. I call her <laughs> Yeah, I like the P90. I love her. Yeah. She's so cool. I really I like the P90, too. and not just because I watched the one Sword Art Online thing that's actually good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Little pink P90 girl, I like Yeah, that oh, Len um, is so fucking good. Oh, I fucking love her. For me, uh, Leon, I'm my not side really sure. Day, uh, yes, I can really give us... Then Torres, I believe is the name. Oh. I don't think I've ever I'm seen not really sure what mine would drop. would uh really be. I know that I have attachment to things due to specific video games. I'd probably yeah. say the Springfield MT903 or M1903. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um oh. only really because mostly not just and this is weird because it was Medal of Honor Frontline, specifically that one, that probably <clears> gave I loved using that gun in that game. That was fun. Um, oh. but I would probably say the BAR as well, as yeah, a certain BAR. housemate of mine, as a housemate of mine was in the military, and in the military they called that gun the big ass rifle. It does have fire three thirty eight. <laughs> I think so. It's it, it's the Browning automatic rifle is what it stands for. But yeah, I'm pretty the sure it's the big ass rifle. rifle. Yeah. And it's like okay. yep. it, yeah. it, it, it fires. It fires what is typically marksman rifle rounds. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Automatic. Yeah, and. But the reason why I fell in love with that gun, specifically in Frontline, was because of the sound that it made. I oh. don't oh, think yeah. the BAR goes boom, 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 in real life. Oh, I don't think it sounds uh, like that, but it's mind. a good noise. Uh, yeah. Though Sorry, I'd, probably say, I'd probably say, because I'm a marksman kind of person, I like marksman the bar, rifles. The, the bar fires 30-06. That's still, okay, yeah, I'm, that's still around uh, as meant to take down fuck. a large game. Yeah, I just I got that. told something not good. <laughs> uh oh, what's that? Turns out my psychiatrist back in um in California can't actually prescribe me shit up here in Washington. Oh no. Mm. That's, That's a bit of a problem. Good. So okay. I'm gonna need to find a new psychiatrist so I can keep getting my Adderall. <laughs> yeah, at the moon. Oh boy. Guys, I found Junji Ito. Apparently, he's part of Twink. <laughs> my favorite my favorite firearm is the 6 hour PG-26 yeah yeah just like I don't like the um like just I like the P90 exclusively for aesthetic reasons it just looks cool especially yeah. when it especially when it's pink yeah I, I honestly think that in my capacity I don't know what I'd really say is my favorite firearm but as of late, I've come to realize that I quite enjoy marksman rifles in general, um, purely because really I'm someone who, who would like to fire from far away. Um, but <laughs> I'd say that I'd probably say that one of my favorite would probably be, I know this is not a marksman rifle, I don't think it is, but I like the G36. <laughs> um, and the, the G36 reason why, is, um, I, consider, I think, a battle rifle. Yeah, is it a, a battle rifle, really? I think. I'm pretty sure it's an assault <laughs> rifle. I, think it, I don't know. It, it's an assault it, rifle and a light machine gun. But mm. Well, uh, yeah, but then it's also considered a, an SMG if you play Girls yeah. Frontline. Battle <laughs> rifles are technically, like, mm, uber yeah, uh, modular. Yeah. So. Also, as long as it shoots, I don't know enough about firearms to make a choice yet. Uh, I know a decent amount about firearms because one of my girlfriends likes info dumping about them. Yeah, that, that's Viona. Viona and I have very elaborate conversations about firearms sometimes. <laughs> but if um, I'm going to be perfectly honest, I'd probably say that my favorite would either would be a toss-up between the DSR Subsonic, uh, the DSR-1 or DSR-50, or, um, this is probably going to be a really dumb one, uh, the PTRD. Mm. Just the because PTRD, I love anti-material rifles. Horrifying. 
<laughs> I love anti-material guns. They're God, the best. yeah, anti-material. Oh, God, yeah. The PTRD like blurs the line between anti-material rifle and anti uh, and anti fifty meter radius. Yeah, thing. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you standing within fifty meters uh, of me? So that works. You are vaporized. Yeah, anti-material, yeah. anti-material wi- um, rifles are fucking wild. Rifle. I was about to say rifle. 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 Yeah, rifle. Girls front line. <laughs> yeah, 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 basically. Okay, so Joyce so Joyce in the machinist line is a fucking badass, okay. Right? Yeah. Right. yeah. <laughs> yes, sight eating bastard! Next time I'll enter the shaft twits your thighs! Yes! <laughs> like just just put her in a fucking Nia voice and it's perfect. Yes, I've always heard her as like aggressively Welsh. Uh, I yeah, love exactly. Her. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. Uh, yeah. Six RP twenty six is my favorite handgun. Yeah, just like. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, just like quote from Stef um from Stefanovin. Are you not proud to you who to enjoy everything she knows about shooting and spitting colorful profanity besides? <laughs> Colorful profanity. Oh, that's great. You What's know what? Just, just, just in honor of this, I'm gonna have to swap over to my other character now because <laughs> yeah. I, I, I now need my my big Welsh wolf in this, and, they're, yeah. and, and they have mechanistic max, so I get to show it off. What you're, what yeah. you're in for? Yeah, yeah. no. You know, jo okay. I look. Okay, I've known Joy for about five seconds, but I want to kiss her. <laughs> um, yeah, there you go. Sounds yep, right. that's welcome to the mechanist uh. quest line. Aggressive Welsh and uh, guns. Aggressive, yeah. uh, the most aggressive oh, hello, energy you yeah. can ever have. Hello, Zyka. Wonderful to see you. Mm -hmm. Welcome, welcome. 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 Thank you, Yeah, we're talking yeah. about guns. We're talking about guns and angry Welsh girls. Mm -hmm. Hot girls with yeah. guns. Yeah. I think, I think one of my favorite rifles by far is... The, um, a mix between the, um, the AWM, which is Arctic Warfare Magnum. <laughs> I mean, y'all is in the war. Yeah. That case is in, case, in case you didn't think that, uh, yeah. in case you didn't think that a sniper rifle could penetrate a house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. That'll, that'll work. I could, I could live with that, sure. Yeah. Wall Just like a dragon, not really. Oh, wait, do you get to be a pirate as a machinist? Yes. Uh, Good. There's a lot of pirates in the machinist quest line. Yar motherfucking har. Yar. Welcome to the Sky Pirates. Hell yeah. Hell fucking there yeah. Is actually, there is actually a cosmetic set that's called Sky Pirates. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. And they are in, in the game. Mm -hmm. Looks like making it, that's for sure. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I'm talking to a Sky Pirate right now. Oh yeah, Zyko, Zyko uses a modified T50. Nice, yeah. Which, which is one of the craziest looking guns I've seen. Alright, it, it so... Absolutely insane. Now here's the alternative question that I was gonna, I'm now gonna have to specify as a totally different question, but in a similar vein. What's your favorite fictional firearm because i have two <laughs> hmm. fictional specifically uh, fictional i can't uh, yeah the xma <laughs> i don't i don't play enough gun games to answer that sadly play enough fictional gun games because <laughs> most of the ones i end up playing do just have real guns in them all um, right steel barreled carbine equipped and time to put on some fucking clothes okay <laughs> or you could yeah, just be naked. naked. Um, I would prefer to have, like, any armor rating. Like, at all. You have a gun, that's all the armor you need. <laughs> <laughs> the best defense is a powerful offense, and what's better than a gun? <laughs> yeah, it's Caltech. Yeah, just Caltech like, makes some weird yeah, weapons. Just like, hi, yes, I would like to have an item level, please. Okay, I can talk about one of my favorite fictional weapons, but it's, it's sadly real. <laughs> Where the fuck did that? Sadly real. Yeah, have you heard of um? I I didn't remember what the name is. Okay, wait a wait a fucking second. Where the hell mm -hmm. 
Did I just got like a rainbow hat thing? Where the fuck did that go? Oh, the rainbow cap of level fifty. Ah. Yeah. 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 Right. I, I forgot it. Word yeah. Fine. Yeah. I'll. Fine. I know what I'll. I've got a backup outfit. I'll just put um, on my backup outfit. It's fine. Yeah. I'll deal with this. It's called. It's called the Arsenal Firearms oh. AF twenty eleven oh, uh, A one. Nikki, you're, the... you're Nikki mod dropped. I... The modulator dropped entirely. Yeah, probably. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The um, the AF twenty eleven A one, which is also known as the double barrel M nineteen eleven. Yeah. Oh, that's an interesting pick. It's a it's a real gun. Oh, hello, Puddin. Thank you for the follow. Arigatana. Welcome to the temple. Hope you enjoy your stay. You have a good Yeah, sorry. I don't know what turns off uh, voice mod. Uh, it's if right. I, like, tab in too much or something. Um, yeah, so, you okay. You know what? Now, now okay. that you are here, Puddin, I have to apologize. I mentioned to you last night that I was going to be doing the Fate go the, the, the fate Grand Order event tonight, but I moved that up to... I moved that back to tomorrow. Tonight is, is FF14. <laughs> Guess whose sleep schedule is, in fact, shit. All of uh, us. Yeah. I, so I want, like, I'm guessing, like, or actually, let me see what, like, the. Uh, I don't actually have any, like, aiming equip. Uh, so. Actually, no. Um, so dexterity, crit, and zone. direct hit rate are what I want, okay. Yeah. Do you have tomestones? Uh, like I think. Of us here. How many tomestones also, do I have? Please do add me, add me back. Uh, the oh. party, by the way. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, I've got... <laughs> Don't do this to me now, not on stream. Oh, I, I, I know that there are, I, I know I'm... that there are derringers, uh, chambered in 4570 governments. I am trying to, like, answer people's questions. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I've got 376 tombstones, so... Oh, I can, that's like, it? Get... Uh-oh. Yeah, I need to get more. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, so, oh, no, you know what, no, the magic, what you just said, damn it, you actually are correct about that, I, I can now, there are now three of my favorite fictional guns, I don't know how I forgot the third, I'm an idiot, so my first yeah. is the Buster Cannon from Gundam Wing, I'm yeah. sorry, but that gun can punch through an entire space station, yeah, I'm, I'm down for that, All right, and the I've... noise it makes is pretty good. Alright, I've got a starter machine, this outfit, and... Now, dear god, I need to fucking run because I'm level 30 in a level 50 area. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, I will I will tank for you then. Gunbreaker. Gun gun gunbreaker. Gun gunbreaker? There we go. <laughs> I don't know why it didn't alright. Royal Guard! Alright. So now I stock um now I talk to Rosenthal. Yeah. And that gets me hypercharged. Um, my second favorite would be the charged particle cannon from Zoids. Oh, uh, yeah, it's two hour I breaks just love, I just love gun that fires beam so big it vaporizes literally anything that comes, even in remote yeah. close contact with it or its aura. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. <laughs> now, okay. my yeah. third stands out from the rest, the Hawk Moon from Destiny. That gun... Oh, yeah. It's just beautiful. I'm I, oh. I'm a sucker for hand cannons. What can I say? Yeah. Oh, hello, non. Great to see you. Yeah, actually, non-fictional firearms. Destiny wins out in a lot of cool guns. It's either Destiny or Borderlands. Oh God. Um. Oh wait. Actually, I am in a level thirty area right now. Thank fucking God. Yeah. Um, well, thanks. I'm trying to think of non-Destiny or non. Where the or fuck like... is the heat gauge? One of those things, you know? I don't know. Um... All right, uh... Yeah, uh... Niall, you on your way? Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm coming. All right, just like... Oh, I am gonna die. I am gonna die. Oh, God. Um, oh, fuck. God, oh, fuck. I don't have... I don't have any potions or anything equipped on my... Item no, unfortunately, bar. I also do not have uh, any... 
healing classes on Hildren. No, so. all I need is you to take aggro. I'm coming. Uh, yeah. Oh, Jude, thank you, yeah. Network. It was at one point, mm -hmm. yes. And that's how I learned about it. It was my first mecha anime. Because it aired along, it was on Toonami. And I grew up in that era of, the best era of Toonami and Cartoon Network. The okay. late 90s and early 2000s. Yeah. Okay, time for me to start um, retooling my hotbars. Look at you in that cute sailor's outfit with your big butt. I like it. <laughs> Don't want the fucking... <laughs> Don't want the <laughs> fucking play guide. Fuck off. Uh... <laughs> Hildren gazing at Lemma very gaily. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what to say to that other than go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> By all means. <laughs> uh, the correct response. <laughs> yeah, there's there's Lemma's. Yeah. Nick, he's two oh, days yeah, away from being a whole year sub. Wow, a whole year of <laughs> it. Wow. Jeez. That's right. My my um <clears throat> my my weapon for Gunbreaker is modded to be the Red Queen. The best <laughs> answer. Can... <laughs> Mount guide. Okay, let's get the Magitech on. Okay. There. Okay, so uh Alright. Time alright, time for cool cutscenes. Let's go. Have let's fun. Go Right. Where the fuck do I find the heat gauge, actually? Here you go, Niall. It's your favorite cutscene. Oh, no, I had to close the stream because my oh, computer no. was lagging. Hang on. Oh, I know. It's not, it's not closed. I turned it, to, I turned it to audio only. Yeah, it's my favorite one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he, gets, he gets the whole shit eaten at him. Mm. He kicks open the door. Oh, Somebody call a doctor. <laughs> I, don't think you, I don't think you have the heat gauge this early, so it's not a huge problem. Uh, I can tell you whether or do you not. Hang on. It's like uh, level 30. I You start at level 30. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, level at 30. I don't think you uh. start with it right away. Hypercharge is at level 30, um, but Heat Blast, the move that you get for it, is 35. Okay. Yeah, so the Heat Gauge itself will probably unlock once you finish this quest. Alright. So, uh, let me head... Oh, boy, we got aggro. Oh, uh, Hildrian, help! I've got your back. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, okay, at least I've got, like, high potions equipped because I'm at a level where they're actually helpful. Also, I'm a healer. Mm -hmm. You've got a pro machinist with you, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Professional gun. <laughs> Use more gun. No! <laughs> yeah, I'm doing incense for like every single job, Lama. Uh, Alright. It's, it's worth it, Fine, no, don't worry. Yeah, there, Jude promoted you. Now I can leave. And now I can do the fuck. Like, just. I. I went over to this because I didn't want to have to do instances. Or more specifically, because I didn't want to have to do instances as a black mage. I, I love the arrow so much. Masterclass start. Cool trick. Hey, do you do parties? Wait, we're gonna have a, <laughs> so it's a good old fashioned. Joy will be giving you instructions. Uncle, and I love it. Yeah. yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. So, joy. All right. Joy time. I'm gonna be. Re Golden Cell be a first target. Focus on getting a feel for range and rhythm. Try to avoid them coils. You don't want to to waste your ammunition. Is ammunition real? I don't think ammunition is uh, no, not anymore. It's not. It used to be. They recently <laughs> changed that, I think, just before or during the first patch of Shadowbringers, and that's no longer a thing now. Thank you. Nice. Yeah. I don't recall <laughs> ammo ever being a thing. It was. You need a very special had, ammo. Had a, yeah. It was a skill called re, called Reload, and they got rid of that that whole thing entirely. Because it was. <laughs> that, that's why the animations are what they are. Um, they added the animation on to the end of the second part of the base skill, which was slug shot. It was split shot, slug shot, reload, and then clean shot. Yeah. Um, All right. Um, I'm gonna take my usual break after a couple hours, and right, we'll be fighting uh, Goliath. So. Yeah, All right. Sure. All right. Now I've got an actual rotation for once, instead of press one, press. One for a little while, then press two. And please. There we go. Alright, so I'm trying to find basalt. 
Yeah. I'm only up to your knees, and I'm the tallest lava fell I can possibly see. <laughs> yeah. right, don't it's care fine. Hildren's, Hildren's younger sister comes up to, like, ju just barely crotch height, so it's fine. <laughs> right, where the fuck do I find basalt golems? Um... Oh, Down there's one. Uh, where do I find basalt golems? There's one! Yeah. <laughs> I was invoking it into existence. There that we is go. How now I'm gonna be a so I mean... I just have to fly. <laughs> you have to fly with your power wheels motorcycle. <laughs> Me and Bring with my, with my, my big girl bike. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There we go. Now we're about Big bay bike. Oh, yes, excellent. Yeah. I'm impressed my connection wa lets me watch four streams at once. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> yeah, like, not even true. using a multi-twitch or whatever? Well, you also- oh no, you, ha you have like a purplish hair. I was gonna say, you also have red hair. It's like, hey. Oh yeah, no purple. Oh wait, shit! I have second <laughs> win? Okay, so I have second yeah. win. Neat, okay. Range DPS gets second win. Nice. He'll, honestly, oh, the right. idea of the idea of Hildren being a Lullafell yeah. makes me gag. Mm. You can, I'm sorry, but you cannot be based on Urbosa and be a Lullafell. Yeah, it doesn't work. <laughs> for, those who, yeah, for, for those who don't know, like I explicitly designed Hildren to make me weak. And that was a mistake, Yay. but I, I, I am up to it. Uh, you have shown me the fruits of that effort. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I have, haven't I? <laughs> yeah, you have. What can I do on Black Mage right now? I kind Big of bitch and bike, yeah. <laughs> Imagine being able to do shit as a Black Mage. I mean, like, I can show you if you want. No, I'm entirely joking. Yeah. Holy shit, it's Next up, we're hunting for bombs! <laughs> okay. <laughs> What Holy do you mean we're hunting for bombs? What do you mean we're hunting for jump for bombs, Joy? Oh. There's pirates around. It's always okay. bombs. Now, all right. Now it gave me the incentive for training incendiaries. Okay. It's raining. How are bombs gonna? These are low explosives. It's magnesium. The bombs it's are alive. Yeah. Bombs. You What's want that them? Music? Yeah. <laughs> it's it's yours, I mean, my it's friend. I use it to my ears. Yeah. <laughs> I, I just got what you were referencing. It yeah, no, that second. was that was internet worm again. <laughs> Ropes, bombs. bombs. You want it? It's yours. Yours, my friend. friend. As, as long, long as you have, have enough rupees. rupees. I'm sorry. I don't give credit. Come back when you're a little <laughs> mm, richer. The voice line that kind of clips the audio. Yeah. I don't do credit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh boy. What cup did you record that in, buddy? Yeah. Uh, or like, how bad did that get compressed? Mm, yeah, honestly. Yeah, it's weird because those games are actually pretty good as long as you use the mod that was done for it recently. Apparently, yeah. Vinesauce Vine Sauce played them both with a mod that I think someone who watches him made for like for that matter and yeah. it's they become actual games it's yeah like, oh wow they're playable and yeah. they're no less iconic <laughs> yeah uh 60 fps zelda rant you've killed me <laughs> yeah uh god i watched the all cutscenes run of uh gamelon at this year's agdq it was spectacular <laughs> which speaking of sgdq is coming up at some point isn't it GDQ? Yeah, pretty soon. Yeah. I have never watched it, honestly. I, I GDQ is a lot of fun. That. I, um... I would at the very least recommend you watch. Yeah, um... um... Well, the thing is, is that, like, with speedruns, I can't take in the game very well. Yeah. So I choose not to indulge in speedruns. Well, Understandable. Well, that's why I say I recommend yeah. Awful Block, because odds are you're never gonna play those games. Yeah, that's true. Awful Block is usually like the very old, janky NES games, or just old, really janky general yeah. games that people there are, find ways to speedrun. But it's it's a very wide spectrum of games because it yeah. goes anywhere from like, um, it goes anywhere from like, uh, virtual high glide all the way to like, yeah, uh, 
just yeah. genuinely like terrible games. Yeah, um, Redfall had like ran at a nice smooth three frames per second though. How can you say yeah, that? Yeah, one of my block? yeah actually there was one game at this year's IGDQ. Um, it was uh Super Ledge Hop. Yeah. yeah. The creator, um, the creator of the game ran it, and the creator, Chair G Tables, is a VTuber. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So they had a fucking VTuber at GDQ because it was a virtual event. They have been adding a few VTubers just because if you watch like their independent streams outside of the major ones, there actually have been a uh, quite a number of yeah. VTubers on there lately. Yeah, yeah, just like uh, I'm a I'm a VTuber that speedruns RE2 remakes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just like <laughs> the advantage of like moving to all virtual events is that they can actually have VTubers running and such. Yeah, it's a great benefit. Yeah. Honestly, if, if they ever figure out the technology, it'd be great to have a mixed physical virtual event. I where it doesn't it doesn't matter if you can make it to the event or not. There is like a branch of GDQ you can be a part of. Yeah, no, I have so actually... Can I, yeah. oh. can I no, say okay. any three words? Yeah. Go for it. Sonic, Sonic Fox VTuber. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> Do you really let's, need to be a VTuber when you already have the fursuit, though? Yeah. I mean, well, that's that's the that's the point, right? Is that It's like, now I can now I can do it in both ways. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, yeah uh, it's just... true. K, K, K the Robot says yes. Yeah. <laughs> Retro Inspector is <Retro, laughs> a VTuber. It's like it's like that gif of uh, like my probably one of my favorite re one of my favorite reaction gifs. Uh, I got I gotta bring that up now because I'm gonna make a whole new source for that gif by itself. Where the fuck is where the fuck is that goddamn third and where is that damn third training incendiary? Hey, <laughs> um. Where is that damn fourth? Yeah, I have act. But yeah, I, I have. <laughs> yeah, I have actually started like um, planning out. A possible way to, like, cosplay as Lemma at a con or whatever. Ooh. Yeah. It'll um. Be, it'll be fun. I can cosplay as Nikita at a con. I just have to. Yeah. There is. The yeah. Hair, but... There is something like very specific that I would want to do to set up for cosplaying Lemma at a con, but, uh, I mean that is already under works. But yeah. Yeah. Where the fuck is that incendiary? Seriously. I don't quite feel like asking the homesucks to figure out how to dye my skin gray for an event. <laughs> arm socks. Well, yeah, no. no arm socks are your best that. friend. I just do my face too, that. though. Yeah. Ben well, yeah, Nycorp's yeah, yeah. gray. <laughs> Hi. Look, you look, you, you know who's, you know, you know my history. I have. I do. I yes. do. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Seriously, where is that incendiary? This isn't funny anymore, game. <laughs> um, Joy is staring at you as you're running around in circles trying to find a shit. You're, and she's just like thinking like, Oh, that was the wrong kind of senpai, huh? <laughs> yeah. I just turned back in and this Homestuck Cosplay Tips in 2021. This is Jude backed himself into a fucking corner by making his <laughs> outfit helpful uh, be... Making his avatar be helped by Homestuck cosplay tips. Yeah. I mean, to be perfectly fair, mine's basically impossible to do. You, no one, no one can be ten feet tall and make it work. It don't work. It can't. It can't be done. Not with that attitude. I mean, I've seen, I've seen like scarily realistic Ragnarok cosplay, but they become an installation <laughs> because, of, because of their fat spider ass. Yeah. I've yeah. seen I've seen really cool abyssal cosplays in the similar like. I've seen um what was what was the one? You I could just do like a scaled like, down version, but yeah. True. And uh, though it really it really wouldn't work. Hi. Because I'm like, no, being ten feet's like part of her character. Yeah. You can't, can't be fake. Yeah. That's one of the things I will not, I will not yeah. accept. You can't, and you also can't Joy. if you're not fat. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Joy, pl can you please help me? Uh, I still have tubs of model magic in my closet. Oh boy. Yeah, seriously, <laughs> where is the last training incendiary? Why won't it tell me where the last training incendiary is? Please. I'm begging you, game. I need, I have 18 minutes left, and I don't want to spend the whole time looking for a fucking single mob. Ah, what the I fuck? Really not tell you yeah. where that is. No, mm -hmm. not for that.
that nope, one. Not at all. It's they, so, hang on. They just want you to figure it out if you're, like, do it yourself if you're so goddamn smart. You see training incendiaries. Uh... Yeah, um, the quest is named Master of Marksmanship. It better not be random location. I don't think it is. Hey, website, can you load maybe? <laughs> I beg of you, please. Yeah. Load website. Ooh, I've got an interrupt ability. Nice. Yep. Range GPS got this one. Nice. Ooh. <laughs> can't learn things from from reading also uh, me doesn't want to watch a video walkthrough no <laughs> yeah uh is that no that's a fucking note another fucking condor come on please i am all right i gotta do it good luck thank you for your help uh so okay so where have you gone so far for the okay so you did the basalt golem yeah like just the if they've got like um x y coordinates i can just mark all three and then like um figure out which ones i've been to already there's one comment saying thank you i got stuck on the quest you're not helping <laughs> that's just ridiculous <laughs> did, you I got, I love did, it. You, did you did you get the training incendiary by the two corals uh possibly i the one I that was in the same area as the as the um there it is, motherfucker! How the okay, fuck yeah, do you get okay, over yeah, there? Yeah, yeah. How the this fuck the do you get over? I... Yeah. How the fuck do you get over there? All right, so where are you currently now? Yeah, uh, I am just stuck yeah, in the little back, gorge. Yeah. I can get out. Yeah, I went up to six streams at the same time just to cry, just to try. Holy crap! It works just fine. <laughs> so it's just fine. Wow. Liking your solid bandwidth. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I still need to. Yeah. I'm doing, like, a big cleanup of the apartment and, like, finishing up move-in stuff tomorrow, and I'm gonna... I really need to install my fucking Ethernet cable that I just haven't done yet. Ethernet? Yeah, like, just... I've got good wireless, but, like, my upload speed is not what I would like for uploading videos. It just takes 15 minutes to upload a VOD now. That's pretty good, yeah. But, like, it used to take, like, 5 to 10 on my old network. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just, like, the issue is I'm on wireless right now instead of wired, so if I plug in, it's gonna be better. Plug it in, plug it in. What the hell was that jingle for? I already forget. <laughs> Probably not something I can play as a black mage, let's see. Have fun. I if really I'm wireless, I can barely watch one stream, yeah. You're streaming wireless? Yeah, I got a good router and service, so yeah. Or, not router, I got a good modem and, yeah, modem slash router, but yeah. I'm streaming wireless, my bandwidth is a mess, oh fucking well. <laughs> you want her to fail. I ain't letting you cheat his lordship. If you're gonna bend the rules, no. then so will I. Why is that? That would be. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, I don't know. Dangerous love. Yeah, uh. Ooh, cheating scum! Come on, Lena! Alright, dust all my acids. Okay. Alright, dust all my acids and tigers. Oh, and this time Joy's actually le leading me where to go. Can I kiss her yet? Mm, probably not. That's Boo! Not for you. What? Oh no, she's underage, isn't she? 
No, it's, it's just that she's she she may or may not have a crush on the 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 main guy that runs the manufactory. It's been a while since I've done that. Uh, not. I don't care. Yeah, Let me kiss. Some heteronormative yeah. bullshit going on. I don't fucking care. Let me kiss her anyway, Yoshi P. Yeah, mood. Oh, Let me God. kiss. Oh God, Lemma, you're gonna die when you meet Hilda. Oh boy. I just now remembered that. You want a sexy <laughs> you want a sexy Welsh muckiness? You've got Hilda for you too. Oh and boy. Actually, I think some some homoerotic content between Joyce and Hilda? So Oh yeah. Okay, okay that's fun. Yeah, that was for the 80 quest. Yeah, that was for the level 80 quest for muckiness, the one that's at the end of Shadowbringer's content. Yeah, okay. yeah I remember that now. All right. Well, yeah. Okay. I will keep that in mind. Plus, like, Hilda's a she's a gang member, or gang leader, even, so it's like, yeah. Yeah, yeah I hell yeah. Kindness. I mean, like, just, I I can make friends with gang leaders. I've, I know Yuma Yamano. Plus, you become her friend anyway, so hell it's yeah. like, oh yeah, you can, uh, yeah, like, yes. Yeah, so, yeah, that yeah. is far in the future. I am, I am, I am a mere level 30 right now. Yeah. Uh, add in some more for Hildren and that she makes her own gang she makes her own gang I, I love I love Nico's energy so much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, yeah, Nico yeah, uh more GMC, yeah. Mm -hmm. There we uh. go. Yeah. She'll probably get behind you, but <laughs> well I mean I wouldn't I I wouldn't turn her down. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a bottom, alright? What can I say? Everything <laughs> I make is art, whether it's a gun. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, Jesus! No! Uh oh. Duty failed, I got killed! No. Oh. I should and also probably a... mention that hey, Machinus right, does have a few really hard quests, so. Yeah. It's been a long and time. And now there's a duty on top. Oh god, no one else is here anymore, yeah. right? Uh, there's a duty right on top of it, so. I'm about to die, and I can't take the quest. I can do it easier. I can get out of the second. Where are you currently? Um, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, Outer Linoskea, uh, 15.9, 16.8. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, Helter Skelter, yes. Uh... Bottom yeah, Bottom I'm just. Yes, we call that face down ass up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, Jude. When you get here, I am just. I'm here. Yeah, I'm just lying <laughs> down dead. Occasionally, by help skeleton. Oh, I probably shouldn't have joined in the face thing. I'll have to give me a sec to actually res you. <laughs> oh boy. Unfortunately, Hilda does not have any classes that does that. I it's apologize. okay. Yeah. I can wait. Very well. I can do that. All right, body, body. First Hi. Body. Uh, help. Uh, fifteen point nine, sixteen point eight. Yeah, I ran. Go. Yeah, I ran away before dying. Thank you. Ah. Uh, okay. <laughs> you uh -oh. walked right into that one? Yep. Yep. Yeah, uh... Well, it kind of just spawned here, so not too much you can do. Yeah. Do be like that. It was your fate to fail, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to see the... I, I, I'm, I'm honestly really eager to see the um, the ones on the moon. I really hope there's going to be one called Moon's Haunted. Yeah. <laughs> there better be. Oh, man. That better be, the, that better be the mission that takes you to the moon. Uh, that will be even better if it's an MSQ quest name. Absolutely. All right, I'm just. All right, so I'm just like, I am getting into this duty. So yeah, before I yeah. have the chance to be attacked again. Okay. <laughs> all right, yay! Now I'm taking the easy one. Yeehaw. Ooh, free XP. Yeehaw. And them revolvers like Ocelot. Yeah. You're pretty good. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Golems will be a first target. Focus on getting the feel for an ancient rhythm. 
Try to avoid them coyotes. Don't want to waste your ammunition. I come oh, back and hear him erotic. Yeah. Yep. Welcome, welcome to, welcome to the power of gay streams that we got going here. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. We were talking about how gay the um folks in the Arcanist um in the uh or Machinist guild are. Oh, there's actually somebody playing Mission Three right now. Hmm. Because I just oh, I just connected to the network. Oh. DMC Five oh, had an yeah, DMC Five has an interesting thing to it where um, if you're playing Nero, it'll connect to someone who's playing V, and uh, you can watch V doing their stuff on their side of the on the on their side of the mission. Nice. <laughs> okay, so for anyone who for anyone who doesn't know this, I want you all to look up a picture of V from DMC Five, and then a picture of uh, Adam Driver, oh, and no. then internalize the fact that the devs had absolutely no idea who this guy was. Oh and no, it was really? Purely coincidence Holy that they shit. are basically one and the same. <laughs> and I think yeah. Adam Driver said, "Hey, what what is going on here?" <laughs> Even he was confused. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, the best, the worst, part of, the worst part about this is, however, is that I've I made some really cursed content. I want to see if I can find it again because I I remember posting it somewhere, but I need to find this now. Uh, I know I gave I sent it to my daughter a while back. Let me see if I can't if I can't find Next that. Next up, we're hunting for I'm bones. Okay. okay. I'm I'm getting it. I'm learning how XC works now. <laughs> Are you? Yeah, well, there, 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 you can grab it off, off, off the side and stuff, but you can also grab it after an attack and it'll charge. So, LT is just going to be mashed in between combos. But yeah, I'm currently matched with, I'm currently matched with another player right now who is doing V stuff. Interesting. So if, uh... So if I complete my mission early enough and go to the railroad track, I'll probably see them doing their thing. Alright, that is two things down. Okay. Alright, so this is gonna take me a few minutes to find this, to find these uh, pictures. I gotta note the self, save these images so I have them <laughs> on hand for next time this happens, because it is oh. a cursed revelation. Uh, it, it is, oh, yeah, it is that... madman's knowledge. Uh, yeah, feel free to, like, drop them into the voice text or whatever. I'm going to. Yeah. Here they are. I found them. <laughs> <laughs> I will check it now once I'm done with this. Is technically is spoilers for a Shadowbringers NPC. Alright. Uh, go, 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 You, you want her to fail. I ain't letting you cheat his lordship. If you're gonna bend the rules, then so will I. Uh. No, I'm not going to apologize for this. <laughs> I also say how much I love procedural soundtracks. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Niall, are you dropping it in the voice text in my server? Or? I I am doing that now. Okay. All right. Uh. And the other one. There's nothing, but there's nothing better than doing so well that you get the devil trigger drop. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Nikki, you're gonna want to look at this, by the way. All right, hold up. <laughs> hold up, hold up. Let me. In voice text. Yeah. Yes. I'd say, uh, honestly, Judith, Jude, if you've done the um the Eden quest, oh, no. you should probably check this out as well. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh, <laughs> so you, no. Know, you know who you know who Gaia is, then. All right, good. Yeah. <laughs> oh no! Oh, I hate it. <laughs> uh. Thanks, thanks, I hate it. <laughs> Don't at me, cause it's true. <laughs> hey, don't diss my girl Darkness, all right? She's cute as all hell. Yeah, she is. Well, not hear slander about her, or or honestly, really much of any of the real main cast in Two Love Rue. I I love Two Love Rue. That was yeah, fun. Two Love Rue series. Yeah. Oh. Two Love Rue Darkness got done. Yeah. Hey, Nikki, hey, chat. I couldn't sleep. Okay. 
Welcome back, Scrappy. Does anyone know how to write punchline? <laughs> how to write no. punchline? Is, is that the is that the is that the whole action? I guess. Go with the flow. Right now. Yeah, I know you can ride the rocket arm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. I just don't know how. You gotta go with the punch, duh. <laughs> oh, thanks. Very helpful. <laughs> yes. Yeah, let me, let me... God, why didn't I think of that? Oh my god. The only upset that this was Mia? The red, the red... The, I'm oh, not yeah, a rocket was. scientist. Wait a minute. <laughs> Oh god, yeah, that's right. The 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 wife of the guy who wrote and was doing To Love Rue, his wife essentially ruined the series because Oh my god. Haruna in or Har is that what her name was? Haruna? I think her name was Haruna. Um she shares her name with my with my um oh, she, she was based this on the fun. writer's wife at the time. Ah. And apparently through some they what? had a what really, really song? bad falling out. Oh boy. And uh, partway through, I get—I think the writing for Darkness, I think, she was like, I want royalties because that character is me. And that's why that character was written <laughs> out completely. Yeah. Because the original <laughs> plot line was that Rito and Haruna were like kind of like looking at each other as a couple, but then Lala comes in and kind of introduces the concept of harem, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, um... But uh, yeah, it was Harna, uh -huh. and the, the the big the big problem was that they, Zero, she was written out. You draw a line and then draw a fist hitting the line. Duh. Oh, of course. <laughs> 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 All right, back to uh, the oh, oval. To the sand, dude. Oh, that was oh that that's why darkness started. Mm. Okay, I see. Uh. Yeah, so it was basically a series reboot essentially. Yeah. I see. But hey, Yummy has Yummy has a hot mom, so I mean. Mm -hmm. We got we got a hot MILF character that isn't just the doctor. Oh. Fair enough. Look, I don't know I don't know why, but it's like I'm Oh my god like our right. sexy school doc is hot. Hell yeah, I get to kill Rustenthal now. Woo. That's a move. Lemon's got talent, but he, even she can't win against Rustenthal. I'm doing, I'm doing well, Zero. No worries. Right. I'm always doing good when I get to stream people. V Fest Warriors of Light. What is what is your wisdom, <laughs> Nikki? Nikki Gordon, Nikki, don't travel alone. Jude says, "Remember that you, nothing. There is something you can't overcome." Hildren says, "Murder's okay." Yeah. And then <laughs> I don't remember what the last one is for me. <laughs> I don't remember what the fourth one is that I would end up being. <laughs> the combat in this game is so. Yeah. 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 yeah, no, like, uh, yeah, no, no, what is the fourth one in that, like, sort of thing? Because that's when I would be. I, I think that that was the fourth one. Like, the, the, the fourth one is the one qu asking the question. Yeah, ah. Uh. <laughs> you ever play Doom? Yeah, I'm actually yeah. ridiculously good at Doom 2016. Um, what? I did a 100% playthrough of Doom 2016, um, on the second hardest difficulty in the game, because... Nice. There's no way I'm doing an LP on Ultra Nightmare. You gotta be, oh, you gotta yeah. be on some, you gotta be on some kind of special <laughs> demon crack to want to try to do Ultra Nightmare. As yeah, LP. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Ultra, Ultra Nightmare is a rite of passage, but still, someone managed to pull it off on like the first day. Ultra Nightmare. And, one and, and the funny thing is, is that you can actually, it was actually clearly someone who was really good at it because they straight up almost died like at the in the second third of the game mm. <laughs> when you're against the cyber demon that is like insane you know, okay yeah all right uh, let's, let's was that wise my lordship the hollyanark coffers ain't exactly fit to burst in Put a price on good people, eh, me lordship? Ah. Oh. Lemo, can I just say that I absolutely love your Welsh accent? <laughs> <laughs> she, she's a great, so great. Hey, she, she's a great voice. I'm on. I'm autistic. I'm good at echolalia. Is that, there is a name for it then? Yeah, echolalia. I'm so glad I learned 
this now. Yeah, echolalia is like when you like um habitually or instinctually imitate stuff. Yeah, and that's why I'm so good at that's why I'm so good at doing voices and doing stuff as yeah. well because I just did it ever since I was a kid. Yeah. Hey Jude, uh, can you yeah. invite me back to the party? Oh sure, just let me. Yeah. Not uh, busy yeah. in PSO two. Yeah. Um, I. I want to do some. Yeah. Oh, it has a name. It does have a name. Yeah. I um. So, uh, I want to do some leveling roulette so I can get a uh, machinist leveled up some. That's got, fair. Yeah, I've got. Let me just run away yeah. from this. Take your time. And yeah. Run two MMOs yeah. at the same time. Yeah. No. Uh, take your time. We've still got to wait for Nikki to come back too. Um. Yeah. Royal guard. Yeah. Once I'm done with this mission, I'll log on and help. <laughs> Because uh, I had to close the game, otherwise the game's not going to be very happy. Yeah. <laughs> my, computer, my computer will not be happy with launching two games at once. Take your no. time. Especially when it's DMC. The RE engine, yeah. so beautiful, is pretty intensive on PC, mm -hmm. which it has all the right in the world to be. No. Yeah, are we, wait, are we actually just making a new party from scratch, or? No, they're, we're still all in a party. Ah, all right. Or at least I think we are, unless we are. Up yeah. I'm still in a party. No, me. no, my account, my 14 is still running. Like, ah, all right. I, I can run both 14 and PSO okay. at the same time. Yeah. I thought I always thought it was just something everyone was doing. No, neurotypicals don't do that. Actually. <laughs> Optimus Primal. I like that name. God. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. All right. Now I've got hypercharge. Yeah. Yeehaw. Right. Right. Yeah, let me just let me just go ahead and do that real quick because I just now realized that uh, I haven't I don't think I've shown that on stream yet, but I want to show what, one of my favorite uh, pictures of Hildren. I took. Ooh, um, Here, you get you get this you get to yeah. hang on. Yeah, I'm gonna pull up your stream for that real quick. To uh, to answer your question again, Scrapper, I have played uh, Doom, I have played like all the Doom games. Okay, there we go. Nice okay, Chrome background, by the way. Thank you, <laughs> Mommy Friedrich is life. <laughs> she is actually named Mommy in my game because I I, mm -hmm, I love her. <laughs> nice. She calls you my child and everything. She oh plays up the Mommy angle hard. Yeah. It's hey. like Toriel. Pete, yeah, Pete Gage, you go down where the fucking like um fire ice thing used to be. Gage, yeah, you also doing... you also go down to like eighty percent. There it yeah. is. Brutal Doom, Hyper, oh, uh, Brutal Doom Hardcore Realism is very intense. There, okay. You're pretty but good. Social. But there. Brutal Doom is also an entirely different beast compared to Doom 2016. Uh -oh. Yeah, that is a very nice... That is very nice, Nile. <laughs> yeah, um... Oh, so this one, I take the one that I'm the most oh, proud of. Oh, there it is. Okay. Right. Time to yeah, get right. uh... I am gonna Hello, quit. Zyko. Hello, Zyko. Hi, Zyko. <laughs> Puddin says those claws are not very home obsessed. <laughs> <laughs> See, I would install that mod, but. But. Okay, as as, now. As long as you trim the two most important fingers. Oh, well, yeah, that, that's the joke. <laughs> yeah. Apparently, that mod's no longer on. on um, apparently, it's no longer on. Uh, the mod archive anymore. Ooh, Apparently that was a bit too much of the implication. Meanwhile, there's like gigantic um <clears throat> Yeah. I say that, uh, the pillars will be having uh rivalry. I mean like just like <laughs> well no, you know what it is, right? Mm -mm. Homophobia. It's like just the other stuff is for consumption of of cishet male audiences. The two um the two cup fingers are for lesbians. That's the oh, difference. Yeah. Yeah. Two cut nails, yeah. Like just that's the difference there. Ah. Modded X. Well, see, that's the thing is that Squeen did did outright mention that as long as you don't loot Lullafells, they are okay if with you modding again. So long as it ain't too lewd. And that's yeah. fine. <coughs> yeah, just like... Ah, I don't know where that came from. Cut nails aren't <laughs> Cut more... Cut my own spit again! <laughs> F. Why? 
Ain't too lewd. Yeah, um, yeah. speaking of lewd, uh, in well, the awesome. modding scene, is that a challenge? <laughs> wait, um, <laughs> weapons, uh, wait, are there no... Alright, where the fuck do I get a better gun? Off the market for it, but since you just started, there probably won't be anything. What, it's illegal this... to buy here, but it's totally okay to own. Wait, um... I hate that logic so yeah. much. Yeah, uh... Um, actually, wait, I... Oh, no, I, no, I don't have the two... I don't have the tombstones for it. Uh, uh, I wanted to get the, um, Augmented <laughs> Ironworks <laughs> Match Attack was, Repeater. Uh, was awesome. The Ironworks gun would be a little Which was the anyways, barrel? Was so. the one that shoot the big laser? That's the one that shoots the big laser, yeah. It nice. was... Uh, God. Uh, it's cool. I, I, think it very, I think it's very much meant to be a gun to reference it yeah. for the GTO one. All right, yeah, so, yeah, uh... Yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah, uh, I mean, when are... Yeah, Nikki, do you have, like, an idea on when you'll be ready to do, uh, um, like, a uh, leveling roulette? I'll, I'll launch FF14 real right. quick. Yeah. And get it ready, because I will have to load in, but... Mm -hmm. um, yeah, this um, is towards the end of the mission, so... Mm -hmm. I'm on your server. Zyka, what server do you play on? Because I... My, my two mains on Aether are on Siren. Yeah, um... Yeah. But I also play on Primal. I play more on Primal than I do anything else. Oh, oh Balmung. Oh, you're also Crystal. Ah. Oh no, Balmung. I'm, I'm on Balmung. Oh, I feel very sorry well, for you. I can always join you on Balmung, so I yeah, have I, plenty of Crystal I am, characters. I'm gonna be making a character on Crystal soon. I do have an alt on Crystal, but I didn't do anything with them because I, I didn't have the, the will to do it. Um, but the, the character is named Daddy Bowsette because of a joke with a friend of mine in my okay. free company on Primal because they have, they have a Bowsette character that's married to one of our other friends that has a Peachaboo oh. character, you know, <laughs> yeah. Princess, Princess Bowsette. And I have a character named Daddy Bowsette who is a Highlander based on the dark-skinned version of Bowsette, which is my favorite because the dark hair, red, the, the, the dark skin red hair look is just... Mm, yeah. Awesome. Yeah. And big buff, <sighs> yes. It's good content. Um, yeah. but like I only made it because I wanted to grab that name. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, no, uh Celadon really want yeah, like just I've been promising Celadon for ages that I would make a crystal alt. And I've got like the character design to do it. I just need to think of a fucking last name for the main character soul in Silicon. Hey, at this point, with data center travel being a thing, and you can also spend money to transport literally any number of characters to any server, which I also just recently found out, was that apparently you can select any and all of your characters for a set price of $18. It's like, hmm. so it's like, if you want to transport all of them, that's a good deal, yeah, like, but if it's one or two, it's like, that's a bit expensive. Yeah, and I've and only got doing... one, I've only got one character, but yeah. Oh, imagine that's cute. You have Bowsette fan on your phone. I have a whole ass organized folder of Bowsette <laughs> pictures, and, not, and, not, and most of it's non say so. Good. I'm uh, not, uh, no. <laughs> I play on Primal because my, my free company is there, so. Yeah, uh. There we go. Yes, Puddin, it is organized. It's organized by theme. Actually, where are you right it's now? It's organized by degenerates. Yes, it's, it's, or, it's organized by what, what the basic theme is. More it, are these ones more transcoded than the rest? That goes into that folder. Uh, mm -hmm. Do these ones involve uh, Bowsette with a... <clears throat> uh, how would I describe that in an innuendo that makes sense in Mario? Extra mushrooms? Uh, that has its own folder. Does this one involve uh, her being really gay with Peach? Has its own folder. Does it involve any good, fun, wholesome content of uh, Bowsette Jr.? Mm -hmm. That has its own folder. Does this one have any good, wholesome content of Bowser Jr. original and Bowsette, you know, with, with uh, trans memes? That has its own mm -hmm. folder. I'm very organized with how I organize good. my folders. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kicks in the door. I'm your mother now. Okay? <laughs> 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 well, 
Lena, this is cute because let me go ahead and do this one. I have a macro for this. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, yeah, I gotta react with that, don't I? Yeah. Is that like a separate action from just pet? Or? <laughs> hey, Psycho, this is your first time seeing this image. Do you, do you like it? <laughs> my, my, my chat block image? <laughs> you want? Jude, Jude, read it again. Read it again, Jude. Oh, uh. Oh god, it's so small on my phone now. <laughs> um. Here, I can. I can. Um, it's also. As well. Yeah, it's also in the Discord. Yeah. Discord. <laughs> uh, how about read thy newest read, the Boruto? <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, Daddy Elf would be a Boruto fan! <laughs> <laughs> so this is drawn again by by an art bud of mine who goes by Frank Tonius on Twitter. They do a lot of strange and or fetishy art for the most part, but they do some real quality shit posts when they go about it. Yeah. They also play FF14. I think they play on, on Crystal. Um, but I absolutely, they, they are great, and they are also probably the one, the first person I ever commissioned of a proper OC of mine, and I love that they were able to dig it to design flawless. <laughs> yes, yeah. Psycho. I wonder if there's boobs on that page. <laughs> You're right, Puddin. Like, what's up, Psycho? I'm ki no, you. Yeah. No. Uh, no. No, Niall, you. you're, Niall, oh, you're cute as hell. No. Yeah. <laughs> I'm scary. Spooky, but also cute. Uh, I, sh I honestly, I honestly should have made my model basically Churio from My Girlfriend's a T-Rex. <laughs> okay, can I, okay, you know what? I don't need to say, can y'all, if, if y'all are, if y'all are gay, please read that, please read that manga. It is absolutely precious. It's not, it's not gay. What's it called? But, yeah, My Girlfriend is a T-Rex, um, you say? Um, T-Rex na Kanojo. Yes, uh, my girlfriend's a T-Rex. All right. It is... It is so cute. Churio is just me. She can't stand being called cute because she's supposed to be, like, the scariest dinosaur. But it's <laughs> it's basically in a world where dinosaurs didn't go extinct. They evolved uh -huh. over time to be more human, and now they're basically uh, dino-tars, essentially. Nice. So, like, from the, the waist down, they have the dinosaur body. From the waist up, they have the body of a human. Oh yeah. But they have, or rather, I guess like from that part, I don't know, it's really weird to explain, but they are mm -hmm. very, very cute. Yeah, And Makes they sense. are just my favorite. Alright, while we're here, I'm gonna buy a few, mo a few more high potions because for some fucking reason you can't get X potions till Stormblood. Mm -hmm. Yep. Why? Really? Apparently. I'm, I'm in queue at the moment, I'll be back next time. Right. yeah. Uh, like, that's what I've heard from folks. Dumb. Yeah. Would you like- well, wait a minute, here's a question. I can probably go buy you some. Would that work? Uh, yeah, just like, I don't need X potions for Machinist right now. I'm level 30, so I potions are fine for now. I will be perfectly honest with you, I've never used potions in this game, ever. Uh, yeah. Oh, also, I do have second wind and, wind and such. Oh, yay! Yeah. All right, Nikki's in. Woohoo! All right, so we're just... Uh, are we gonna do a uh, leveling roulette or uh, 50... Or I can't do 50 through 70 dungeons. I'm level 30, so we're doing leveling roulette. <laughs> yeah. All right, so here's a question before we go in. Who yes. wants to tank this? Oh. I'm, I'm, I am a tank main by nature, so... I mean, if you want to tank, I may as well just get some black mage leveling in. Yeah, so that'll be Nikki for healing? Is the class that I, that I would like to level yeah. is, it, is too low for this still, so... Yeah. Uh, Nikki, you there? Nikki has his step away All right. for a second. Yeah, so... Yeah, I think Nikki on healing, uh, dude on black mage, and Niall on tank? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. As usual. All right. Yep. I'm ready. Okay. Of course, now the real question here is oh, whether nice. or not um, I will get in trouble. 
for one particular reason, and it's odd because I, I should probably not mention it outright, but I have <clears throat> edited sounds, as it were. Oh boy. I'm, I, let me say, I people were very disappointed. I am too disappointed with the sound effects for Gunbreaker. Mm. Hope you're ready, by the way. Right. Yeah. Uh, everyone ready to commence? Bunbreaker, yes. Bunbreaker. <laughs> Bunbreakers are the best. They, that gets oh, my. Yeah. That's, get, that gets my. <laughs> that that pulls my devil trigger, as it were. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Not a hotel. <laughs> yeah, that, that reminds me of an old. Yeah, that reminds me of a really dumb meme the silent I made. Oh, by um, the way, Puddin, you see Nikita's character here? So. I can't believe yeah. she's a shard of Mitsuki. Mm-hmm. What did you say? Um, <laughs> yeah, so, one of the... So, Recital occasionally has some very fascinating uh, strokes. Um, we refer to them as strokes because it's just a mind break that they have on occasion. Mm -hmm. And sometimes they just say things that make no sense whatsoever. <laughs> uh, so, we were talking about DMC5, and... Uh... Recital misspoke at some point talking about the lyrics of the song or singing along or whatever, whatever it was. Yeah. Or maybe it was just a bit that we were talking about. Uh, but now there is a photoshopped picture that Recital has on standby of, of uh, Nero turning into a certain Winnie the, Pe Winnie the Pooh character oh, um, and, calling it, and calling it a devil tigger. <laughs> God. <laughs> Spectacular. Here's some paladin for you. I'm DMing them right now. Let me find, let me get that picture for you. I'll send it. Oh, it's nice to not have to stand in one place to cast now. Right? Welcome to the good version of the gameplay. Yeah. You know, if you don't have cast times, just mash buttons to win. Just reload times. <laughs> yeah, I just, I just DM'd recital. Do you have the devil figure me? I might need to show it. <laughs> oh, yes. Hmm? No, Zyko's telling me about yeah. her bun breaker, and I, uh. that bun can break me. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right for Zyko. Yeah. <laughs> I still need to, ha like, hang out and chat with Zyko more. Like a I just would highly recommend. Would I highly recommend just like just playing games with her. Yeah, I, was, I, I was just like. I was watching you two play Chivalry two last night, and I was just like, oh, I love this. This is the best. <laughs> yeah, I just like. It's hard for me to like actually get around to like organizing stuff with people. <laughs> yeah. Mm, yeah. Like usually, folks yeah. need to like reach out to me or whatever. I'm trying to like organize stuff on my own more. But yeah. Yeah. A uh, bit. bit worded it very well when we were talking about, uh, when we were on Fallout 76, we talked about it quite, quite a bit, um, how Bit has the same level of anxiety as I do, mm -hmm. where it's just really difficult to reach out to people when you want to play games yeah. and stream together. Um, so, I kind of, I'm usually the one to, to ask people <clears throat> for class all the time, so I know how difficult it can be. Um, and it turns out that's, like, the best thing ever, because you get people who are like you, that are just like, I want to make friends, but I'm also really scared to make friends. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's pretty common from what I've seen on Twitter, at least. A lot of, mm -hmm. a lot of YouTubers have the same thing. Yeah. That's why we um, become VTubers. Yeah, basically. <laughs> yeah. Oddly enough. Speaking of VTubers, though, uh, a pretty big thing happened on Friday. Oh? Uh, I was featured in a certain compilation. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, I saw you ping about that. Yeah, I, I made sure to, to shout out... Uh, I made sure to shout out the the VTubers that were involved in it. Uh, obviously, Roki does stream, but they don't have a Twitter, so I couldn't yeah. shout them out. Mm -hmm. um, oh, Zyko doesn't have that issue? Well, you are a true yeah. top, then. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> <right. laughs> yeah. You are 100% right. It would be great yeah. if I had the game screen on right now. Yeah, no, Zyko, feel free to, like, just... I would love to do something with you sometime. Oh. <laughs> Not in a horny way! 
At least but what if you want to play with I will Brian not publicly Jeff, admit. Not online, yeah. I will not publicly admit to that, Niall. <laughs> <laughs> publicly, but yeah, fair enough. Yeah. But um, I, I will say that like part of my issue is that I am someone who actively avoids PvP content because oh, it's not same. fun for me. Because yeah, I don't, same, I, same. I don't enjoy it, and it's like I feel like if I'm not enjoying it, my viewers won't <laughs> enjoy it either. Even yeah. though that I know there are people who love watching people suffer for no good reason. Oh like, my god, these these Brigham's gloves are actually helpful for me. Holy shit! But the sad, I, the sad part is is that. Unfortunately, a lot of the good collab games are all PvP based. Yeah, like, that is like sad. a challenge. Yeah, there need to be like more like good co-op games and such. I should go like Overcooked there's, there's or whatever. Really good. Yeah, there's a lot of really good co-op games. We're actually doing like uh, you can also go unorthodox. That's what that's what we're doing. Um, yeah. Nobody in their right mind would play a co-op uh, fucking FF5. Yeah, I mean. The thing is, is that FF5, a, a lot of a lot of FF games actually had co-op hard coded in, so yeah. you could allocate which which controller <laughs> control which party member. But this is the GBA version, so we're yeah. just doing four player one. Oh controller. right, we're doing GBA uh, version. Uh, the GBA version just looks a lot nicer. Yeah. Psycho, you wouldn't happen to play Monster Hunter, would you? Rise or Psycho, Psycho, Psycho plays a ton of Monster Hunter. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, we should play that someday. Yeah, no, uh, folks have been trying to kidnap me into Mon Hunt for a long time, so, yeah. Yeah. Don't worry. I will, I will succeed in this. Yeah. <laughs> please teach Lemma, please teach Lemma how to play Monster Hunter. Now, here's the thing, though. Think, here's the thing. You uh -huh. mentioned uh -huh. you have a capture card right now. Does that mean that you, you'll probably have to, you want to start with World. Because it's, good, it's a good place to start. And yeah. I have yeah. cleared that game completely and utterly, meaning I can carry you through everything, or sit back and watch as you experience yeah. things, and then um, jump in if is, I have to. Is, yeah, it's just like, I don't know, Lemma, is your PC strong enough to do... I, I've got a... I've got, like, look, I can, like, just, as long as it's not RTX, I can do it. Yeah, okay, that, that'll do. Yeah, because yeah. world. Like, just, I could play Control non-RTX, so... Yeah. I, I do know how it would be on it, though. Yeah. Plus, the, the, the sad part is, though, is that World is really shit-optimized. Like, yeah. Capcom uh, can't do good ports most of the time. Yeah. So, yeah, it's just like, yeah, it's just like, I've got a Ryzen and a 1660, so I'm pretty good when it comes to non art Yeah, yeah stuff. You, you should be able to handle, you should be able to handle uh, World, then. Yeah. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Just yeah. to make sure, you have a non-NVIDIA graphics card? It is an NVIDIA graphics card. Okay, so so you have an NVIDIA one. Yeah, I have an NVIDIA one. Okay, okay, because I was gonna say this game does not tolerate non-NVIDIA graphics cards very well. Yeah, no, I've got an NVIDIA 1660, so yeah. Okay, so yeah, you should you should be yeah. fine. You're, yeah. you're better than mine. <laughs> yeah. Think. I have a I have a GeForce GTX 1050 Ti. Yeah, that's what I used to have. I upgraded yeah. to the 1660 when my old computer fried. Yeah, you're Just you're, you're golden. Yeah. Just because, like, it's the minimum one that has, like, the dedicated encoding sector, so, like, I yeah. can stream without it hitting on my game or whatever. Okay. Good night, Fiona. Yeah, night, Fiona! I need, to, I need to get a better computer, because my CPU is, is like, bottlenecking everything these days. Yeah, I could, but um... the, one that, the one that I have in mind is, like, $1,500, and it's like, I don't have that much, but I don't want to ask for a donathon for that kind of thing. I, I um I, I streamed I streamed Monster Hunter World max ish settings mm -hmm. on a on a GTX 1070 so you should be fine. Yeah. 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 So honestly, um, yeah, Lemma, I say that you start with you start with that. We'll go into Iceborne. Plus, the best part about it is that game is also very easy to mod. Yeah. Oh. Okay, if you're going to need a DMC dumb meme that I made years ago. Um, I yeah, just, I just started playing. <laughs> Yay! Over here now, um, we need one more. Alright. Um, yeah. I, I, I was just playing, uh, I was just playing DMC5, and, uh, we were talking about the, the, the devil trigger meme that yeah. we came up with. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Fiona. Yeah. So, obviously, I need context, because all I did was explain the joke. But it needs context. It needs a visual. We must see it. <laughs> yes. 
Yes, it, I remember it exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so stupid. Yeah. It's yeah. so stupid. Hold on. Yeah, you are oh, very Psycho. welcome, though. Yeah. Psycho, I have a question, too. Since yeah. I am absolutely in love with your voice... Um, I've been considering doing a, a secondary VTubing character that I will do to step out of comfort zones for games like visual novel style in terms of how their cutscenes play out and whatnot. Mm -hmm. Just right. like mobile games and, yeah. and, and, the, and the like. Yeah. Uh, if you'd like, one day I can probably pull you into one of those if you wouldn't yeah. mind. Oh, yeah, no, I would love to do voice work stuff with you as well. Yeah. yeah. Because the character will, will have a much like lower tone and speak more calmly, and I need to learn how to do that because I have a very panicked way of speaking. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. I do need to. I do need to give some context for this. Recital is correct. This did get some clout. <laughs> oh, this, no. this is like Twitter and Reddit famous. Oh no. <laughs> Here you go. A shmentize, you say. Wait, wait. Oh, do I already have an Acetix half robe or something? Oh, wait, no, that's Disciple Magic. I'll pass. Yeah. There you go. I posted it in voice text. I made it day one of the announcement of the game. Yeah, we <laughs> talked about it on... We you talked about it that joke oh. during E3 Back. and you had it done uh, in like Paladin. 10 minutes. Uh... Yes, Zayko. Oh, yeah. I, I, I am... I am in love with your voice. Like it yeah, is. No. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. I'm. It's calming. It yeah. is beautiful. Yeah. Oh and I no. I could literally listen to it all day. Yeah. No. Same. 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 I am. A bit of a crush. I. Oh no. I absolutely have a crush on Zyko because of her voice. Like. Oh. Yeah. Zyko's voice is wonderful. Yeah. I have a. Cr I have a crush on Zyko for other reasons. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I have a crush on Zyko for other reasons too. Just especially the voice. Yeah. The mm -hmm. voice is. The voice is a. A, a big bonus. Yeah. But yeah, no, like, Niall, if you ever want to, like, do, like, uh, VM reading or whatever, I'm happy to do, like, uh, voice acting with it, too. That would yes, be absolutely. Hella fun. And, yeah. yeah, I will, I will definitely pull you into this, and I will. Oh, yeah. The first thing I gotta do, though, is I gotta, I gotta find a, a good voice modulator that I like. Yeah, uh. I don't, I don't want to have them too similar to yours. Yeah, to, uh, to either of yours, obviously. Yeah. yeah, well, luckily, um, voice mod lets you, like, do full customization. Yeah. Yeah, like just that's the great thing about it. Yeah. Mhm. Mm yeah. So once we're done with that, you can go ahead and take a yeah. look at me if we got time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And like it, I think it, it, it is can alter terribly because I mean I can just do that and turn it off anyways, yeah. and it's not like <clears> that <throat> big of a difference. But I just have like a basic echo going to make it sound yeah. heavy. Yeah. It's the same over here. <laughs> Tinny. Tinny. For the most, for the most part. For the most part, I could just make a better voice module that sounds identical to him, but I like the sound. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I heard, like, I, what I wanted to do was I wanted to have one that set, that would have, like, this, a similar voice uh, modulator that alters tone and or pitch that makes it sound like GLaDOS, but yeah, I realized do it doesn't exist. Yeah, you can do that. Yeah, um, there's, there's you no can't, like, like, just... You can't make it sound exactly like GLaDOS without, like, doing some stuff without, like, speaking in a more GLaDOS style like this. I, I can't yeah. do that. Yeah. I actually, I don't know why that redeem's gone. I have, I had a redeem for me to do the turret voice. Oh, because yeah, I can't do that. Part. And it's Are one of my favorite still there? voices to do. Yeah, no. Are you still there? Yeah, no, abs you can absolutely get a modulator that sounds like GLaDOS. Super doable. Like, the right way? Um, yeah, I'm yeah, that, uh, yeah, I, I, I love... Uh-oh. Oh, God, help! Jude, 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 help! I got you. I got you. We're going that way. Yeah. Uh, we're going the, the right yeah. way. Nice, HP. Let's go. Single yeah. digits, baby. Single uh. digit tanking, yeah! <laughs> that's, that's what I call... That's what I call optimal healing. <laughs> <laughs> I need healing. God. Oh, God. You know, I, I, I love... I honestly love... Uh, Oh, you have new redeems as well? Oh, this is good to know. Ooh. I, had a, I had a redeem for the portal turret voice, and uh, I am absolutely going to add that for, for Nova. But the entire... But like, I, I, I don't know. Hmm? Recital, no, I didn't hear that. Oh, no. Uh -oh. I rolled a one on the mount last time I did farm. Oh, no. Oh, that hurt. 
Oh god, there's a lot of things yeah. going on that Price I'm being... Ah, uh, there's... <laughs> oh no. Oh, it is uh, still there! Fuck. Okay, so someone... Uh. Okay, so someone just redeemed that. I forgot... It is still there. That makes me glad. Um... Uh. So let me see. Uh... Yeah. Which, uh, which one I'm... Am... start with? God, there's a lot of stuff going on. Like, just... Uh... <laughs> there's, like, planning for a... Event... For, like, a thing I'm gonna be in soon going on in the background. And there's a lot... And... I'm still trying to, like, figure out, like, how- what all the rest of my stuff does. Oh god, lots of stuff going on. Yeah, yeah. Uh, um, yeah. Yeah. Y'all will, uh, find me on a certain Twitch channel at some point. <laughs> In the- I didn't, not... know you, I didn't know you managed to do a collab with Bob Ross, that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh. Happy little uh, lemmas everywhere. Yeah. It, it's a real shame that he doesn't really communicate with his chat, but, you what? know, whatever. He does <laughs> Wait. No. Niall. Niall, you have made a grave error. Uh-huh. You were assuming that Lemma could ever be little. Oh, good point. Yeah. Good, good joke. I like that. Good joke. <laughs> there's, there's, pl there's plenty of Lemma to go around. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. So, okay, so someone redeemed the portal turret voice. So let me go ahead and do that. All right, take are your time. You still there? there you are. Hey, it's me. Where were the other ones? Why am I blanking on this? This is my favorite thing to do. Why am I blanking on it? F. <laughs> I forgive you. I won't. I I don't hate you. I don't blame you. Please put me down. This isn't love. It's murder. Oh no. Oh boy. Nikki, help! Uh, uh you're I'm, fine. Yeah, you're I am now. Fine. I am very squishy. Don't worry about it. I don't have regen. Help me. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Attack the tail. Trying. If scorpions suffer, attack the tail. I'm trying. It's not letting me target. Finally, it let me target no, the fucking don't, tail. Don't attack it. Don't attack. Don't attack when it's in its shell. Destroy the scorpion. <sighs> oh, no. Six percent drop. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no. Oh, yeah. Man, oh. I, oh, Zyko, those are fucking weapons. Oh God. Yeah, they really are. I saw those, and I was like, I'm gonna save for a personalized Ara Ara, and yeah, then I'm... hopefully I won't be on stream for it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you should be. Oh, yeah. That, that, that's okay. a weapon, though. I want... That, that, that'll, that'll make the brain melt faster than Neurotoxin and GLaDOS Ara Ara. Okay, so, uh, yeah. um... Okay. Uh, oh. Okay, right so. there. Uh, I got... And then Terry, Terry Van Terry's Needles, which is completely useless to me. Uh-huh. Okay, what is, um... Okay. Oh god, oh here. Jesus, oh god, oh fuck, oh Christ, I just lost, I just missed a lot of very important stuff. Yeah, uh, so how long did this take you to make recital? Because it's ridiculously high quality. Uh, damn it. Everything, for, everything from the text and everything. This was like 30 minutes, I think. And you had posted it in the server. It was right after they announced DMC5. Okay, see. Alright, time to put on <laughs> new, less bad equipment. Do I have anything? Alright, so. Zyko, have you. Have, uh, can Niall do the Uwu voice? <sighs> Probably a little too well, if I have to admit. <laughs> Friends, three. I mean, I've mentioned before that my vocal oh. range is pretty stupid. Your vocal range yeah, I mean, is really good. It, I have a lot of... Like, well. like my, my, my vocal range is weird, because I can do, like, the, the, the small anime girl voice, and then immediately become the Dr. Claw from, uh... <laughs> from... Oh, what, I don't know what all it's like on that. Inspector Gadget. Inspector Gadget. Or I Megatron. You. <laughs> okay, it's what like, the... you know, like, Hi, hi, Onitan! And then just immediately, I'll get you next time, Gadget. Next <laughs> time. <laughs> I, I answer. And then okay. of course you got the hara hara. You know, I can do that as well. It's just it's it's one of those weird cases of I think it's mimicked everything for too long. God mood, yeah, fucking echolalia. Yeah. Um oh yeah, Zyko, have you you say Fudo? 
What? Uh, let me simp for you. I love you, Seifudo. Let me simp! D.O.S. Shrimp. Shrimp. Megatron calls you Oni-chan Asmer. <laughs> but no. Okay. Um, a lots of... You failed me yet again, Oni-chan. <laughs> honestly, hey. honestly, if it question, didn't like, kill, if it didn't kill someone's voice to do that forever, I mean, it, it'd see, be a great beat voice. Like, yeah. I can do that longer periods than I can the lowly the lowly voice. Oddly enough, <laughs> purely because I think I've done growls and roars for longer, I can't yeah. hold high notes, but low ones I can do pretty good. Yeah. Question by okay. was, have you heard my loot auto auto redeems? <laughs> right. <laughs> Yay. Because I right. have one for that. Yeehaw. My item level is now up to 18. Ooh. Perfect. Uh. <laughs> nice. Sits and looks at 477. Yeah, so I'm... Just, there, so just there. as a reminder, um, the meme was Omen, posted. you mad lad. Omen just redeemed a loot auto auto. <laughs> you say in a quivering shy mess. <laughs> <laughs> now that was because my voice broke for a second, but I apologize for that. Um, I, I, need to, I, need to pre I need to preface this by saying this was, I'm pretty sure this was like 99% recital and we just made a joke about, we, we just happened to make a joke about Devil Tigger. And, uh, <laughs> okay. so. That's going to kill me every time I hear it. Oh, yeah, it was, yeah. Like, it was like, oh, well, good night, if, if, yeah. if you want to. If you want to, if you want an image burned into your brain, I okay. did in fact post it in yeah. voice text. Oh, so. good night, Kay. Okay, Thank yeah. you very much for hanging out. Been super fun. Uh, enjoy the night. Uh, yeah. Sorry, my like attention has been so scattered tonight between like the Adderall stuff and the other thing that just came up with. Yeah. I don't want to talk too much about yet because I'm not sure if I'm allowed to, but I'm excited for it. Yeah. Yeah. Also, no. We're more. Yeah, okay. I mean, that VTuber curse if you say it right now, it won't happen. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, the thing, I mean, I, I can talk about my thing because, you know, it's, it's happening. I have the first episode done. Yeah. Yeah. You and have to do and it's great. A bunch of people. Mm, thank you. Yeah. The, the so, amount um, of feedback I've gotten back on it has been mostly positive, which yeah. I appreciate. It. All right. I'm just going to head back to Foundation for now. Yeah, uh, I'm going, let me, let me go ahead and get that Ara Ara out of the way. Okay. Uh, let me see if I can get a good tone for this. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. How's that one? <laughs> hey, let me try a different one, hang on. <laughs> uh, not fair! Yeah. I have a pretty okay one. Megatron, Ara, Ara, oh Christ. <laughs> Alright, you know what? Since I got two people asking for it, I may as well. Oh no. Ara, Ara. <laughs> <laughs> Food, regular, soft, breathy. Ara, Ara. Ara, Ara. Someone's a cutie, huh? <laughs> Hang on, no, wait, no, hang on, hang on. Ara, ara, kawaii, nai? Okay, so, I have, I have, uh, I have one for you, Lena. Oh, no. Ara, ara. <laughs> uh, so what the fuck should I do about the fact that I'm now 20 levels under anything in MSQ? <laughs> There's only one yeah. thing you can do, Lena. Leveling roulette forever. <laughs> Uh, grind, no, grind your face against whatever the highest level dungeon you can do is. Over yeah. and over and over until you hit the new one. There Which is... Which friendly would be a fuck manner. Mm. Well, yeah, what's a good one to grind your face against? Because Lady Almadine hot. Yeah. So, I mean... You, you play, you do level like roulette until you get your, until your XP boosted face is done. Okay, so yeah, I high guess high I'm high. gonna still have to be Black Mage if I want to progress in MSQ. Well, Lemma, this yeah. is the fun part, right? Yeah. Now, because you have at least one other person, 
You're a DPS, I'm a tank main. That'll make Qs go faster. Ooh, and fair, we have yeah. Nikki here, who is a healer, so that'll give mm -hmm. us near instant Qs, provided mm -hmm. Nikki's able to stay fair, around. Yeah. Ooh, Candyam! My are staying at this. Yeah. Ooh, mm. Candyam, well, thank you very much for following. Welcome to the network. Yeah. Can yeah, woo, heavens rude. Yeah, I just got machinist, and so I'm. In hell, oh. because I can't do any more MSQ right now. Wait a minute. Nikki, yeah. uh, not Nikki, uh, Lemma, where, where are you currently? Um, I'm in, just in Foundation. I'm, hey, like... I want you to... Let me, let me, let me get a... Let me remember Thank you for the Hydrate Speaky Beans, place. and also hello. Yeah. Come to Bed Branch... Bed Branch... Bed Branch... Bed Branch... Bed Yeah, uh... That's not been, yeah. Brent Branch. <laughs> yeah, I've been having a lot of fun with FF14 so far. This is the first time I've strayed outside of Black Mage, and, like, just, I just entered Ishgard literally today, so yeah. Yeah. Uh, alright, the sun has finally set, but it is still 70 goddamn 3 degrees outside, I'm in hell. Yeah, it's very uh, hot in my room right now, <laughs> and I need, to, and I need to cease. I'd offer you a hug, but I myself am quite hot in the body temperature areas, and... I also sweat really easily, F. and I know that there are some people awesome. I mean, like, that. I mean, like, awesome. anyway, I mean, like, still, like, either way, I'm, I would not turn down a hug from a cute girl, like, no matter what. <laughs> Alright, well, that rules me out. sweaty mother, mother hugs. <laughs> uh, Alright, well, that rules me out. Question. I can give hugs, but... <laughs> okay, so, first of all, what I'm gonna do for you yeah. is I'm going to... Uh, do this. I'm going to attempt to build up enough uh, gauges here for you to understand why Mechanist is the best. Okay. I have... I cannot even begin to comprehend a single thing going on right now. These are the... These are the powered-up versions of your basic combo. That's the mm. first one. This is okay. the second. 28,000, okay. Uh, okay. 26,000. Remember, remember how I mentioned that um, I was with Mocha, the Mocha Otaku one night, mm -hmm. and we did a original, like, level 16 Ifrit in three seconds. Yeah. Allow me to show you the skill that did this. Okay. Oh, that was a direct crit for the record. Okay, 60K then. damage. Okay, here we go. You ready for this? Watch so. next to me. Yeah. I, oh yes, I the robots. The re the whole reason I picked now, this Here's class. the thing, though. On my screen, it's infinitely better. Why? Because it's a fucking Gundam. Holy <laughs> shit! Now it lasts longer depending on how on how much gauge you had when you triggered it. Yeah. So unfortunately, I couldn't do it for very long at that particular yeah. moment. But um, oh. I couldn't get it back. So mm -hmm. hang on. I gotta get a hundred for this. Yeah. What did I do to mommy? <laughs> to mommy Ifrit? I drilled Ifrit very hard <laughs> live on stream. <laughs> I got the I got the smuggest cheat eating grin on my face when I said it that. Is that <laughs> nice? Oh, Automaton Queen, I turned her into a Gundam with a cool ass cannon. Yeah. Look at this shit. Look at that. There's a mobile suit. Yeah. How could you not want this? That's cool as hell. This is peak mechanist. So, uh, we should talk a little bit about what is planned. Oh, yeah. For the crew. Yeah, probably important, you know? Probably important yeah. to bring it up because it's going to be a consistent thing for a while. Uh, yeah, a few um, months, probably. Not a few months, only like a couple months. Yeah. FF5 is pretty short. Mm -hmm. But, um, uh, from now on, uh, Saturdays are going to be dedicated to Four Job Fiesta, uh, because, uh, everybody that has played FF14 or is like the original Four crew, mm -hmm. um, myself, Jude, Lemma, and Bit, mm -hmm. we're doing, uh, Four Job Fiesta, Four Player, One Controller. Ooh. And, uh, it's already off to a good start, 
because the job that we got first is Berserker, so that means for the first couple of streams, we're not going to be doing anything. Uh, well, I mean, we'll be we freelancers too, but yeah. We'll be, yeah, we'll, we'll be freelance. Yeah, we'll be freelancers until we get to Water Shrine. <laughs> Once we unlock Berserkers, we're all Berserkers. Yeah. Yeah. yeah Goss, this class is so sick. Yeah. Uh, it is very. Yeah, it's very cool. Well, I mean, it, it depends on if we get another water job or a fifth job. From yeah, we do have fifth job on, yeah. But, uh, yeah, we also have fifth job. So we're doing pure chaos, which means that any job, including mine and freelancer, are put into the randomization pool. And when nice. Gallop is replaced by Kryle, then it re-rolls to Earth job. So we're going to be dealing with a lot of nonsense. Um, most importantly... Uh, all of the playthroughs are beatable. It's just going to be very, very chaotic because yeah, you know, the GBA yeah. version of FF5 doesn't have, doesn't consider, you know, four people playing the same controller. Yeah. So it's going to be a lot of menu mismatching, uh, absolute chaos, cats and dogs living together, Ghostbusters. <laughs> yes, thank you for making that reference. I love that. It's one of my favorite references. Cats and dogs living together. Mass hysteria. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Yeah. I, I, I can't confirm it. Hell yeah. Yeah, honestly, like, just, I really hope it doesn't take us too long to get to, like, another job, just because, like, I don't want to just oh, be... Yeah, All right, good. Just, um, I don't want, like, a whole stream of just sitting around doing auto attacks. Um, yeah, every... Uh, again, FF5 is fairly short. You'll get all your jobs in, like, the first, uh, eight hours, I'd say. So over the course of, like, two streams, we'll get our four jobs. Mm -hmm. Um, it depends... I mean, it depends on a couple of factors. It could take three streams to get to Earth yeah. Crystal, depending on some factors. But for mm -hmm. the most part, we're gonna get, um, in the first stream, we're gonna get two jobs. Yeah. If, if we if we time everything right, we'll be able to get water crystal done. Yep, yep. Um, the real challenge uh, comes from the fact that if we don't get a wind or a water job, we're going to be all berserkers, and there's kind of a gatekeeper boss called the called the sandworm. Yeah. Um, where if you auto attack, where if you attack a, a sand pit that doesn't have the sandworm in it, mm -hmm. then It'll uh, and then it'll retaliate with uh, a, a move that slowly saps your HP. So yeah, four berserkers for that fight is scary, but two berserkers is manageable. So I'm expecting. Are fun. you getting Are you getting told you're cute because it's true? Yes. Mm. <laughs> it is true. Very true. <laughs> this is cyberbullying. It's it's cyberbullying because you're adorable and sir. Mm. I mean, I made the patty emote, so I don't think I have to say much anymore. Did, did you ever think, Lemma, <laughs> that, you know, you are just a beautiful, unique person, mm. and <laughs> the world would be different without you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> the same goes Lemma, to everyone. I want to give you a mental image right now, Lemma. Okay, are you ready for this? Uh, sure. Revolver uh -oh. gun. Out of ammo. Open the cylinder. Bounce the booba. Rounds come out of the cleavage. Swipe <laughs> the gun and catch them all in midair perfectly. Pull the cylinder back. Shoot again. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, I know, that, that, I know that anime. And it's called Grenadier. Holy I've never seen it, but I've seen the gifts. And yeah, they are I, have, I have seen the fucking <laughs> gifts. I, I've also seen the gif of somebody shooting a sniper, shooting a sniper round between... That is rest. from High School of the Dead, and the yeah. best part about that is that somebody actually calculated the speed at which those boobs are supposed to be shaking. And it was at, it like, Mach... Apparently... Mach yeah, the speed is, like, Mach 5 or yeah, something Mach like five. that. Mach yeah. Five. Mach that, 5! Yeah. Mach 5! To the point that, apparently, at that speed 
speed of oscillation, they should be making an extraordinarily ear-breaking, shrill, high-pitched sound. <laughs> yeah. So, I think Psycho Fusujima is some kind of god machine in order to be able to pull that off. Without destroying the frontier drums. I uh, want to surpass Metal Gear. Ah. <laughs> 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 uh. If this is some useful, useful knowledge, yeah. <laughs> this is what this is what happens when anime has science meet. It never yeah. ends well. It never ends well. Uh. Well, I mean, at that point, it might not it, end well, but it ends cool. I mean, uh, yeah. He casually looks over to Mecha Godzilla. Remember, uh, uh, I, Mecha. Have you? Yeah. Nah. Have you seen Godzilla Singular Point yet? Yes, I have. Oh, I it's. Watched it. I know what you're about to reference. Uh, that stinger had me scream. Yeah, oh, it's so fucking good. I'm so... Can I, can I just uh, about that for a second? Yeah. Okay, so Hi, all right, uh, no, spoilers no, ahead. No. Spoilers Every, ahead. The show's not out on in U.S. for a few days, but holy yes, fuck. Yes, it's going to be out on the 24th, and what I will do is on Friday, I will be holding a marathon of it in my server. Um, yeah. at around oh. the time that I normally stream. So about 9 p.m. EST. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um, Watch along. So uh, for anyone who wants to join, you're free to do so. You want to type in the, pa the the exclamation mark Discord command on Twitch? There you go. Yeah. Um, so for those who may not know, every single Godzilla has, has a nickname associated with its suit or aesthetic. So, for yeah. example, in the, tw in the 2002 movie with... Uh, Godzilla against Mechagodzilla, no relation to the first two movies. No, first three, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> uh, that one's called Kiryu Goji. In yeah. the one with Godzilla versus Biollante, that one's called Bio Goji. Yeah. Um, the name for this new Godzilla, for its yeah. final form, because spoilers, apparently Anno started some shit with Shin Gojira. Uh, thanks, thanks to the Akiano. This one's called Godzilla Ultima. Yeah. <laughs> when I found that it's, out, I was like, are you fucking serious? <laughs> it's fucking Ultima Weapon. Unleash Ultima. Such devastation. Was... This was <laughs> not my intention. Ah, <laughs> uh, the means. The DNA of the soul. How do I, how do I stop aggroing the striking dummies? Uh, just walk away from them. Just get, a, get far enough away from them. I think because you're attacking them, I can't lose their aggro. I went really far if away. Right, if you right-click on their target bar, you ah, should be able to do something right. specifically for target yeah. dummies. Yeah, like just... I'm oh, way far it. away now. Yeah. Neat. Yeah, like just... Niall, I am I way the go. fuck away from you, and it just wouldn't let me, like... Yeah, yeah. ...aggro off, because you... Yeah. yeah. Yeah, sorry. It's okay. Yeah. Um, but for Singular Point, it is a very, very interesting thing. Because the more that I watch, the more that I realize, this is just Fate Grand Order, but Godzilla. Yeah, Godzilla and FGO. <laughs> the weird thing about this is that I have this weird tendency of, like, the idea of Godzilla could be canon in literally any timeline and universe and any piece of media. Yeah. And then I realize, how am I calling this over and over again? So... I have this thing for if, if anyone who knows what Tokyo Mew Mew is. I know, is I've heard of Tokyo 90s Mew Mew. Anime that was my first Magical Girl anime, where they're all based on animals that are either extinct or going extinct in Japan, um, or don't exist in Japan anymore. Mm -hmm. um, but they're all named after sweets and/or foods. So you yeah. have Ichigo, the main girl, strawberry. You have okay. Rikasu, lettuce, because okay. Uh, Puddin, or Booting, who's Chinese, Puddin, Pudding, you know, Zakuro, who is pomegranate, uh, Minto, Mint, you know, there you go. Yep. The five girls, and I have this crossover where it takes place, uh, in real time, modern day, from when that was a thing, so I think it was about 15 years since then, or 20 years. But the plot line was a Godzilla crossover where after the events of Tokyo Mimu ended, you now have three new major antagonists who are Ghidorah, Space Godzilla, and Destroya. 
and they are all ready and willing to wipe out humanity and destroy Earth in the process. Yeah. Because they're just like, this is um, all for this. Yeah. And the main premise was that with all with the with the six or seven uh, Godzilla related magical girls in this, the premise was they all have ties because Godzilla exists existentially forever in every timeline. Mm -hmm. In the 1950s, that attack happened and was covered up entirely on the Tokyo Mimu timeline. So yeah. no one remembers it, except for the one girl who is the granddaughter of the man who watched it all happen, uh, Dr. Yamane. Yeah. So the whole point was their powers existentially grow when a new series of Godzilla is introduced in the real world. <laughs> So at some point, uh, King of the Monsters Godzilla is like actually present and empowers the main girl when she becomes at peace with herself, knowing, hey, you're not just a monster. You're here to save some people. Yeah. Do that. Mm -hmm. And it ends in an actual kaiju fight. Nice. Like she becomes <laughs> actual Godzilla, where like the Ghidorah enemy, who at this point is the only one left, becomes yeah. a new variant called Kami Ghidorah, who has five heads and not three. Mm -hmm. um, and there's an actual kaiju fight that damn near destroys the planet. Yeah. Um, uh. So at that point, oh, like, Godzilla is a picture? point <laughs> present. Uh, yeah, Similar sorry. Uh, Seth yeah. Carrot, thank you very much for the raid. Oh. Hopefully you guys are having yeah. fun and enjoy your time in the freezer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna pretend like I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Oh, that's I can Because I... I, uh, I, I barely watch anime. Yeah. Well, okay, so all you um, need to understand is that the, the general premise is their powers grow exponentially based on alternate timelines. So it's existential. So apparently that's kind of the plot of Singular Point? Yeah! <laughs> is that there's a, there's a timeline AU machine that was built to try and see into the future when a catastrophe was going to happen because it was predicted. So they built this thing to try and focus down when it was going to happen. Problem is, there were so many timelines expanding off from that point, they couldn't narrow it down. Yeah. And it turns out that Godzilla itself is that singularity point? Yeah. And I'm like, what the fuck <laughs> is this? This is amazing. Yeah. And that's apparently correct. it's like, so that's just the plot of Fate Grand and, Order. Yeah, they oh no, and also... The solution to the problem, the way to make it stop. Do you want to know what it is? Yes, inform them. Jet Jaguar. <laughs> I was the solution all along, Mama. What? <laughs> yeah. oh. I also love how they take the species, like they take the different. Mo they have Rodan. They've got Manda, who I was very happy with. They've because got... Alright, you, right, you originally confused me, but now you have my attention. <laughs> yes, they, they, they take all of these uh, other kaiju that mama. exist yeah. and, and, and make them um, species and not just a single kaiju. And yeah. I like yeah. that a lot. Yeah, it's and really cool. Rodan is an interesting one because they're relatively human-sized and while well, they don't have the, you know, I'm always flying at hypersonic speed thing, they are destroying everything because they drop this red mist that just corrupts yeah. the environment. Uh, and I love you, that. Yeah, uh, uh, have, did you ever watch Gridman or Darling and the... Don't you fucking talk to me about Darling and the goddamn Franks. No, but I know what they are. I know yeah. that there's a cute pink-haired glasses girl that may or may not be the catalyst for all the monsters showing because she's, she's a kaiju nerd. That, that sounds like me. And then in Darling in the Franks, I know that's like, I'm gonna pilot my wife who becomes a robot or something. Oh no, I no, um, know. it is basically, uh, take all the good things from literally half a dozen other, um, mecha anime that are actually worth watching, and make them all about teenagers having sex. Yeah, I've heard that. And, <laughs> and then yeah. the fucking, like... Reproduce, yeah, um, marry and reproduce, like, right-wing propaganda, too. Uh. Of course. That, so sounds, it's like, so weird that sounds like, the, that sounds like the RPG Conception. Oh, oh no, it is, it is basically <laughs> the same vibe as Conception. So what you're saying is, I think in the Franx is the mecha equivalent of Sword Art Online. Yes. Yes. Hey, got it! 
<laughs> yeah, no, um, Gridman and its sequel, Dinasinon, are spectacular. They are such fucking love letters to tokusatsu as a genre. Rika's thighs, though. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Rika's thighs. Yes! Um, but yeah, like, I, oddly <laughs> enough, uh, unfortunately, these days, I don't have the attention span to go in and watch a lot yeah. of new anime anymore. But there have been a couple exceptions, and I'm actually upset about one. Yeah. So, I remember when Zoids Wild happened, I was so excited. New Zoids! Yes! This is my first mecha anime! Yeah, yeah, yeah! And they, like, the designs are okay, but they're mounts, not mechs. I'm like, eh. And then the yeah. character designs are just fucking hideous. Yeah. I know it's designed mm. for kids, but just, no. Yeah. Uh, then what? Wild Zero happened, and I was like, yeah! That's more like it! It never got finished getting subtitled because... Licensing. It was all fan subbed. And they stopped when they heard that it was going to get dubbed. And I'm like, don't stop! I want, <laughs> I want the Japanese version! Their voices are better this way, usually. Yeah. But I fell in love with it. And I'm like, and unfortunately, I think due to COVID, unfortunately, that can't, like, that hasn't come out yet anyway. Yeah. So I'm like, I want to finish the damn series! I need to! It's really, really good! So yeah, um, um another, yeah, one anime that just came out this season that I really enjoyed, that's, uh, like, robot fighty anime. Um, it's named Back Arrow. It is really, genuinely, actually cool as hell. I really enjoyed it. It's, like, actually got some great themes about, like, how to true, like, just, it has some genuinely, like, revolutionary themes and, like, what to do when a system is fighting against you. Which is, of course, Ooh. tear that shit to the fucking ground. Yep. No yeah. revolution has ever come without blood and or suffering. Yeah. <laughs> Doc, comrade. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, no. Um, but but yeah, I, that that sounds great. It's it's weird though because I remember, um, like one of like one of the things I think one of the weirdest enemies I've ever watched would probably be Goran Lagan. Oh yeah, um, that shit got weirdly existential. Yeah, no, like just um, both <laughs> Darling of the Franks and Back Arrow like take heavy inspiration from Gurren Lagann, but Back Arrow act Back Arrow actually goes somewhere good with it, mm. whereas uh, <laughs> uh, Darling of the Franks is just like I said, the Sword Art Online of mecha anime. Yeah, more or less, yeah. Fine, but uh, yeah, but but oh, it's like I remember it's like it's, good, yeah. it's weird because with uh specifically with uh uh Guron Logan, it's like I loved it, but I never had the will to go back and rewatch it. It's like yeah. it's one of those things where you watch it once and you're good. Yeah, like just... it was like mm, Yeah. No, I'm okay. It's hyper galaxy sized mecha fighting in existential space. I I'm good. Sure. Sure. I, I joined in. I joined in for uh, adorable brothers and badass sniper bikini. Girl. And then look what happened to fucking Kamina. <laughs> and then and then he he dies weirdly. He get hot teacher Yoko, and then and then space kiss of death again. Size. Yeah. Macroverse. What is happening? I, yeah. But I, I loved it and enjoyed it, but it's like, I don't have the compulsion to go watch it again. Yeah, <laughs> yes, that's the thing, ultimately. It's just like, it's a good, like, just, it is, like, pure, like, it is raw, like, it is pure fucking optim, like, concentrated optimism, but, yeah. Mm. And that's also why I couldn't finish GX. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but like, look, I get it, Judai, but I'm you're too positive for me. Yeah. You're, and plus, oh, it's like I would I would appreciate it if you didn't use the same fucking combo literally every goddamn episode. Yeah. If even Yugi had more variation than you did, buddy. Yeah. Uh, but you know, it's like, uh, but of course, I was spared on that because GX stopped getting dubbed around the time it got good, <laughs> so I stopped watching it because it wasn't dubbed anymore yeah uh -huh. i still gotta finish actually finish 5ds because that went on hiatus for a bit yeah i've never actually um, gotten around to like watching Yu-Gi-Oh ever then then you and i we're gonna have a date night one of these days 
<laughs> yeah, I'm calling it that. I'm dragging you in on this. We're gonna Are watch you... OG Yu-Gi-Oh one of these days. Is no this an invitation? Yeah. Ah. Uh, I think. Yeah. Should I take the implied subtext okay. here? Yes. Okay, got it. I now okay, so now I wanna now I wanna do this though. One of these days I'm gonna have Nova, my other my alternate VTuber design play Yu-Gi-Oh! Because the joke is is that she is basically just a Gaijinka of Cyber yes. Dragon Infinity. Mm -hmm. And I made an entire... Uh, I, I created my own uh, Cyber Dragon based, or Cyber Beast based archetype called yeah. the Cyber Beasts, or mm -hmm. Beasts that use existing Yu-Gi-Oh! art, but yeah. that's fine. Um, but I made <laughs> cards for them that I could put into Edo Pro no. if I okay. knew the coding for it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think I am, like, pretty wrapped up for now, so yeah. He's so cute when you realize you got asked on a date. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh... It's, it's, to be completely honest, though, everyone wants to date my husband. I give smooch. I give head pet. Mm. I hold I, hands. I'll, I'll give yeah, I'm just, alright, I'm gonna complete, I am doing, like, I'm, Actually, I have found a use for some of the, like, side quests in, uh, in, like, uh, Rum Reborn that I never did. Okay. Yeah. If you want, you, know, you and I mm. could spend a few, a few runs getting muckiness up by just mashing face yeah. against a couple dungeons off yeah. stream if you want. Yeah, that'd be fun. I just, like, I do like, um, cleaning off, like, side quests and such. I find side quests fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And um, if, there, if you're if you're level enough for it, you can do that as mechanist uh, and and finish. Yeah. Mm, get, get okay, this was a bad idea. This was a bad idea. This was a bad idea. I have my right target figured out. So. Oh. Yeah. Uh, Yuma's playing. Paper oh. Mario, oh right, it's Paper Mario, Mario Night for Yuma. Yeah. So Paper it's Mario is one of my favorite games. This Yuma raid. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think we'll go over to Yuma. Yeah. Quad uh, what? Quad raid. Yeah, it's some. It's gonna be some sort of quad raid. Just not sure what. Um. I. You know. I don't know. Yeah. Considering we've had a rough mix of Final Fantasy DMC and on my side Fantasy Star, it's gonna be a little bit awkward of one put together. MMO mix quad raid. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, let me go ahead and get the raid command going here. Okay. I mean, like, uh, DMC5 like is technically an MMO. Sure. <laughs> sure. I, mean, I wish there was a the DMC game is, MMO. Are you kidding me? The game is <laughs> fucking Thank massive. You, it's multiplayer, and it does have online connectivity. It is, at the very loosest possible definition, an MMO. Fight me. <laughs> it, okay. is, it is true. By that definition, a bank is an MMO. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh. I mean, hey, you're getting... I'm you're sticking getting to my guns, Nikki. Yeah. Yeah, like just, you're a machinist now. Like, just... With how many of those fuck... Like, have you seen... Like, just... I mean, what is an MMO without exploitative monetization? See? <laughs> See? Alright. Alright, I'm sending a raid over to Yuma now. Alright, yeah, uh, I've, I've got to actually head over to, like, my just chatting and wrap up and everything. Alright, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna kick off my raid right now. Um, yep. Yeah, I am just... That going. Uh, yeah, I'm j gonna do mine in just a second. Is now ending. Thank you for coming. Yeah, uh, thank you all so much for. Yeah, thank you all. Yeah, so much for hanging out, joining in. This has been hella fun. Such a great session. Glad I came here on time. Yeah, it's great to have you here. But yeah. Uh, okay, time to. Uh... Alright, thank you all for coming. Thank you I'll see you tomorrow for uh, Borderlands 3. Yeah, I've got. Um, I'm working on a Vroid commission tomorrow. Gonna be fun. Uh, yeah. Be yeah, uh, thank you. Just, uh... Yeah, just like, thank you, Nikki, Niall, and Jude for hanging out. This has been hella fun. I'm really glad I finally got to Machinist. 
That's just makes me happy. Yeah, uh. So I think my raid call it would be quad fantasy raid. Alright, yeah. I'm going with the MMO mix quad raid, but yeah. Ah. Okay, okay yeah, yeah. Works. when you get over to Yuma, yeah. When y'all get over to Yuma's channel, please don't forget to drop her a follow because she's genuinely really cool, great friend of mine, awesome VTuber, gay as hell. Yeah, go follow her. <laughs> yeah. Oh, All right, right at the end. Let's yeah. Get this, this oh, yeah. Going. Chill, Bye -bye. Ray, right at the end. Thank you very much for following. Welcome to the network. And I just wanted to know what happened. Uh, I have to go right away, but thank you yeah. See ya. Uh, Thank you very I'll much. I'll see most of you. I'll see you Saturday. Yeah, and yeah. all right, yeah, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna head off now. Let's get this raid started in five, four, three, two, one. See you soon. Ah.